towards the future you can't bear You've become a cynic, self-defeating and frozen to the core When you wake from this coma, I'll be here I just want you back from the day Just light the matches and start the fire, start the fire You feel something again, 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 again Good morning. How is everyone today? How are you all? Ooh, I think I have my stream up. Do, do, do. I do. There we go. Who we got? Who we got in here? Meepon, good morning. Meepon, congratulations on your game. Did you find you finally turned it in, right? Cute avatars. Oh, who did you get? <gasps> Who is that? That's cute. You have a little buddy as well. <gasps> so cool. That's cute. I didn't ask to be born Latina. No más tuve suerte. Thank you, Fonsu Chan. How are you? No creepy stuff happening today at the house. Guilty Breed Viking, good morning. Thank you, Nyan. Turned out well. Super excited for others to see it. Dude, I am super excited to see it as well. I'm really excited. It's been really, really fun uh, following along with the whole game dev and trying it out uh, and playtesting it and whatnot. So I'm really excited. Hopefully we can try the, the, final, the final results. Good morning, Steiner. How are you? Todos Latinos con las manos para arriba. DJ. <laughs> Good morning, DJ. Oh my gosh. I almost had coffee in my mouth. Almost. The little avatar is perfect for me. A little white Pikmin. Oh my god, look at your guys' avatars. You guys want some little stars to catch? Hold on, I'll throw you guys some stars. You guys can jump and interact with it. Here's your little stars to catch, you guys. You know what? We'll make it fun. We'll even throw some bombs on there and make you guys fly. <laughs> Is that not cute or what? Even such a great help with it. Oh, thank you. Who said there were some like ticking noises coming from the ceiling? I might live in a haunted house. I think so, Fonsu. I think you may. I think you may. Oh, that's a lot of weird stuff. <laughs> uh, how to jump? I think uh, you'll have to go to the you'll have to go to the interactive like uh, extension or there's there's different commands. I think you could even like fart. <laughs> I think if you type like um yeah, I don't know if that would work. Let's see. Would even fart work too? Hmm. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Your little avatars can fart. 
And I think you guys can battle each other as well. Uh, ain't what's mine meant to be? Oh, aight. That's what we meant. Aight. <laughs> um, nice. That's cute. That's really cute. Loving your makeup today, hon. Oh, Scott, thank you so much. Yeah, it's really bright today. And the light really makes it pop. <laughs> How is everybody? How was your guys' weekend? Anybody do anything exciting? I went to a baptism yesterday, which is a lot of fun. Um, best friend's son got baptized yesterday. And then we went out to eat in town, so it was really, really nice. Um... And because we all know that I can't trust my sound recordings when I test, how is the music? I only did game dev work. We hustling. We hustling. I, I, I'm here for it, Meat Bun. I'm here for it. And happy Pride, you guys. You guys, show some pride love. Pride, pride, pride. And you got exhausted. I saw. I saw that you wrote that. Oh my gosh. I bet. I bet. But how is like the, the relief? The, the stress relief must have been nice, right? To turn it in. The most exciting thing I did was breathe. Hey, but you're still breathing? We gotta be grateful for that. Yes, happy Pride, everybody. Happy Pride. Oh my gosh, are we excited for today? Are we excited? We're gonna be trying out a new game today. A new game called My Child's Levin's Born. My Child Levin's Born, I apologize. Um, you guys can type out the command My Child to learn more about the game. Feel free to join their Discord server. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to try it. So I've been avoiding seeing any uh, gameplay of it because I want to blind react to it. It's so nice to have it turned in. I'm mostly free. You got to post to itch and finish the trailer. Okay, so there's still some yeah post-production work to do. But yeah, no way. Actually, I washed my hair and it was super fluffy and full and like, ah, that's the best. Well, my hair tends to go like really, really, really poofy and very afro-y after um oh nightbot coming in with them deets yes i'll be holding a raffle giveaway towards the end of the stream today um and it'll only count those that type in a specific keyword so stay tuned uh, if you want to win a chance at winning a game code key for the game so that's really exciting and you guys, you guys, I am streaming from my new computer today, you guys. It's, I have the whole setup now. It's so exciting. And I even got a new chair, a Razor chair. Oh my God. And look at my beautiful microphone, you guys. <laughs> also the sound, the alert thingies are a bit loud. Ooh, okay. Hmm. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Yeah, those are always loud. Those are really loud in my ear. I don't know how to, I don't know how to, um, I don't know how to fix those. <laughs> But those are always loud. Um, I want to run the raffle. <laughs> then you got to stay tuned. Nothing interesting at the weekend, but I'm going to Newcastle today for the week for work. Ooh, what are you going to be doing? My hair is always fluffy when it dies, not going to lie. It's just when I wash it, it's soft. Nice, nice. Congrats. Thank you. Thank you, Steina. Thank you. Wait, dries. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense, Fonsu. That makes sense. Uh, let me see what I can do about those sound alerts. Alerts. Hmm. General settings. I don't know. Who knows how to do that? Who knows how to do that? Um. Where are those? <laughs> That's not in my stream loves. Uh, doing a stock take. Nothing. Hug. Oh, you guys are... I see only one of you, the Guilty Breed of Viking. There we go. Wait, how could I win? Hi, Mr. Fox. Uh, so I'm going to be holding a, a raffle towards the end of the stream. Um, I'll let you guys know when it goes live. You guys will see a Nightbot will announce it. Uh, and then you guys will type in a specific keyword and you'll be automatically in the pot, I guess you can say. Uh, and Nightbot will pick a random person. So whoever Nightbot picks wins the game code key. But you ha you'll have to be... You'll have to be here when it goes live, and you have to type in the specific word that Nightbot will tell you to type. Oh, wait, can you do that? Did, did that work? Did the hug Sandella work? Can we try that again? I need to see. Self-love is everything. Yes. And I'm going to be quoting uh, RuPaul. If you can't love yourself, how the hell are you going to love somebody else? Can I get an amen? Did that work? 
Oh, those little those little things are so, so cute. I can see Totoro walking on my TV screen. What's going on? It's little avatars, Oscar. If you go to the About Me section. Uh, oh, you guys, that's so cute. If you go to the About Me section, you'll see the little extension panel on there. And um, it only works for people that are active in chat. I'm not going to be calling out the lurkers. Um, you can choose what avatar you want and you can write out different uh, commands like they just did. They did the hug and you can at somebody. Um, I think there's like a tag and and I can also I can also uh, throw. Oops, wait. <laughs> I can throw bombs at you guys. I can toss you. I could also pin you to the middle of the screen. <laughs> And I can throw you guys some little stars to catch and play a game. So it's very, very cute. Why am I a duck? Can I be? You can be whatever you want to be. You can be whatever you want to be. You can be, yes, uh, you can be a very aggressive Pokemon if you want to. Totoro does give warm hugs. He does give warm hugs. Hola! Hey. Not me getting <laughs> snatched away. <laughs> so if you guys look at the little extension thing, you'll see what uh, interactive codes you guys can use. Hi, Swish! So you guys, unfortunately, there will be no Swish scare today because Swish is not home. Swish is at the doctor's right now, so he's tuning in from either the bus or the doctor's. Probably the waiting room. I assume he's at the he's in the waiting room. <laughs> nice guys oh my god oh god oh that's such a cute oh my god pikachu of course he's pikachu i love it you guys i've been wanting to add this for so long that i couldn't because of my laptop <laughs> you are you are charizard that is so cute <laughs> oh man so, should we start the game? Should we start the game? Or do you guys want to chat a little bit more and play with your avatars? Because you won't, you won't have the avatars while I'm playing the game. Not on the game scene. Yes, hype, 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 hype. <laughs> you guys, I love my stream deck so much. I love that stream deck. Who are you, Fonsu? Who are you? Oh, your beer tech. No, that's not beer tech. That's a. Uh... Oh, what's his name? This is the cutest stream ever. Because of me, right? Not because of the avatars. I hope. <laughs> I'll probably be here for another 10 minutes. Just gonna finish up getting ready soon. DJ, no worries about it, man. Your guys' real life comes first. I appreciate you guys being here at all. I really, really do. Thank you guys. That's adorable. I love these. Love it, love it, love it. Okay, let's see. Should we get to the game? Let's get to the game. I'm really excited. I'm really excited for it. I, I hope I'm not going to be crying some tears, man. I really, really hope. <clears throat> I'm going to hydrate myself. Game! A monkey. Oh, I forgot that one's name. Man. This is so fun. I'm sorry to cut the fun, guys. No avatars on the game scene. I will add them later. Just not for today, because this game... Um, this game is uh, going to be a little bit more serious, a little bit more... Not that not any, not any, that all games are not important. This game is just a little bit more important today, because I am streaming it for a game studio, set up the studios um, from Norway, uh, and they just released the game on PC and console this past Monday. It's been, they've had a mobile version. Um, today is not FIFA. No, today is not FIFA. <laughs> so this game is called My Child Lebensborn. Um, and it is about, it's based on real life experiences during the World War II here in Norway. And um, it's based on, on the Whoa, children. That water's cold. Thank you so much for the hydrate. The children, pr pretty much like children of war. Um, but these particular children, Lebensborn was a Nazi initiated, um, I guess, mission program to create the perfect 
children, like the perfect Aryan well, children. Oh my lord, they just followed you, dude. <laughs> you are a stalker, man. man it's so cool. cool. Thank you so much for the follow, Toby. Came in and straight. Todo Latino con la mano arriba. Oh, Jesus. That was really loud. Yeah. I'm Toki, by the way. Oh, my God. Okay. Well, thank you. Thank you, Toby Toki. Uh, yeah, I gotta get those ads, man. Mama's gotta get her coin. Mama's gotta get her coin. Uh, but yeah. Um, uh, so, as I was saying, yeah, these kids, um, were born of German soldier fathers and Norwegian mothers and just, you know, had to face the worst, the discrimination and bullying and hate. Thank you so much for the dun-dun-dun. You're here too. Oh, both of you are in. Oh my God. Yes. Uh, of course, Toby would complain about the commercial. <laughs> um, I am obsessed with changing avatars. Oh, that's fun. That's really fun. So I'm really excited to try this game out. Um, it has a, a curriculum version of it that's being used in schools currently in Norway. Um, and in some, I, the the community manager of the game was telling me that in some instances it, it, it has been used in other countries as well. Uh, so hopefully, you know, it, it does good, it blows up, and more schools can use this to help teach kids about empathy and, and, and you know, the results of war and how to, how we can actively change. All right, let's go to the game scene, guys. Let's uh, mute this here and bring the... Can you guys hear the game sound? Love is love. Yes. Go ahead and type pride, guys. Type pride in the chat. I went from ice cream to bear to green monkey to gorilla to monkey to gorilla again. <laughs> also, don't forget about your loyalty points, guys. At the end of the month, I will be holding... Um, I'll be giving a little giveaway for the top top loyalty chatters. Um, nothing too too big, right? But something nice, something nice, some game codes or something. Well, listen, Della, you have four hundred and fifty gato taco points. Chip in the house. Thank you so much for tuning in, Chip. How are you, Han? How are you? Yeah, loyalty, my fellow loyal followers <laughs> um it's just points just from just for um for chatting uh for hosting new followers come in with a certain starting set of points um raiders subscribers um if you gift and whatnot bits and whatnot so you, you earn points um and that's why i'm not gonna make it super like i'm not gonna make the final prize or whatever that that grand because you know, my, my, my lurkers are loyal too, so it's just gonna be like a, a small like game code key or something, so because I appreciate you guys. Gato Taco, yes! Oh my god, Penguin came with that awesome name for it. But let me see, let me see. Um, where can I see? So you just type exclamation mark points and you can see your points. Okay, are we ready? Are we ready? You guys, we are seven subs away from hitting 50 subscribers and we hit 300 followers on Twitch yesterday. I am so, so thankful for all of you guys. This is amazing. And at 50, we open another sub emote slot. So I'm excited. I'm tired and trying to multitask with this, making sure the baby doesn't cry and making breakfast. Man, you're amazing. You got this, girl. You got this. Mama work is hard. Parent work is hard. Give that little that little baby a snuggle. I uh, hope you're good too. I'm good. I'm good. I'm excited. Nervous for today. Um, I don't want to cry. I'm probably going to cry. I need to improve my game. I have too few taco points. <laughs> we we're born ready. Okay. Is the, is the sound okay? The game sound? Can you guys hear the little music? All right, let's go. Let's do this, guys. World War II rages across Europe. Norway is occupied by Germany. World War II ends and Norway is liberated. The nation celebrates. After five years of occupation, the signs of the Nazi occupation can be scrubbed away. The music is kind of low. Okay, I'll turn it up. Thanks. Appreciate it. Appreciate. 
bring it up to there. Three years later, you adopt a child. Oh, thank you for taking care of Klaus. He cannot stay here. Adopt Kalyan. Okay, well, I'm a mom. I'm a boy mom. So I'm going to stick to boy mom. Is the sound better, Meat Bun? Or Mr. Fox? I turned it up now. No, this is after war. So this is going to be the results of war. This isn't necessarily going to be a fun... Well, it's, it may be fun, but it's not going to be a, a action-packed game or anything. Um, this is about how our actions as parents, pretty much, or, or in general, not just parents, can affect others. And how war affects others, even, you know, the, the, the after results. It's perfect now. Thank you. I might just shut up while this goes on because anything I say might get me cancelled. <laughs> okay, Wonsu. <laughs> and just remember, Nightbot is is on you guys. Any any cussing in the chat, Nightbot times you out. Okay, I'm home. Yes, you are. Um, okay. Hey, did you have fun with Liv? Hi, Klaus. Was Liv nice to you? It's getting late. Let's get you ready. No, let's talk. Um, hmm... I guess that one. Yep, we had so much fun. Liv is my best friend. We found this cool, kind of creepy looking tree stump in the forest. It looked like there could be a treasure there. Real treasure. But then it started to rain. But we guarded our treasure anyway. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Nightbot. <laughs> I love Nightbot now. He's trained well. But we guarded our treasure anyway. Listen patiently. How, bra how very brave of you, but it's getting late. No, this is your first day. Let's listen more. Let's listen more. And then, and then, and then we found out the tree stump was empty. But maybe the trolls might put some treasure there later. This is just like my son with imagination. So we're going to go back and check later. My goodness, that's amazing. That's nice. Sounds like you and Liv had fun. No, you got to hype them up. Running around in the rain isn't a good idea. No, no, no. You gotta hype him up. Hype up that imagination and the excitement. Yeah, it was amazing. Okay, I gotta go. Sorry for not hanging out longer. Have a fun stream. DJ, thank you so much for hopping in today. I really appreciate it. We will talk later. Thank you so much. Have a good day at work. Uh, nachos. <laughs> yeah, it was amazing. Huh? Oh, it's kind of late. The sun's almost gone away already. See, he's a big boy. He realizes it himself that it's almost nighttime. Okay, so these are time units. Uh, progress through the day by spending your available time units. Uh, certain actions cost time to perform. Time units are indicated in the top left. Okay. Uh, pressing the time unit icon will progress time with one unit. Okay, so let's push it. No. But, but you have to see this. Look. Liv gave me a present for my birthday tomorrow. Oh, it's his birthday tomorrow. That's how I have to answer when Toby tells me something, too. Yeah, you gotta hype him up. You gotta hype him up. <laughs> Can I open it now? It'll be so quick. Yes, we have time. Oh, hmm, that's right. Liv would probably want him to wait for his birthday. What do you think, guys? Should we make him... Well, I, don't, I don't like the first one. That one's like... The second one kind of make lets him choose. But also, it's like his first day here, and he's super excited. Have him wait for Liv's sake. Okay, yeah. I guess you're right. Oh, I wonder what it is. It's good to be excited for the next day. You have received mail. Press the envelope to open it. This doesn't cost any time. Okay. Neighborhood council. A cat has been seen eating flowers from the flower beds. That sounds like my cat. We demand that the cat's owner keeps it inside from now on. Okay. Um, cute. What's that? Oh, just grown-up stuff? Blech. <laughs> you're, you're not going to study, are you? It's so boring when you go there and you promise me a bath. Okay. The tub is in the bathroom. It will clean Klaus in his clothes, but costs a time unit. Okay, well, that's fine. That always takes time. All right, let's go clean him. Oi, my phone. 
Um, just... Okay. Um, I saw... Okay, I did see someone, like, scrub. I saw a tiny bit of gameplay. Because I was supporting the other ambassadors. Um, this reminds me of a game that my child plays on the on on the iPad. So is it time for dinner soon? Yes. It okay. So that probably means that he's hungry. Uh, find. Oh, I get two time units. All right. Find food in the kitchen. Klaus can eat as much as he feels like for one time unit. All right. Mm -mm -mm -mm. He's so cute. Oh, okay, so porridge. Bread with cheese. Very Norwegian. What is the number? Two, four. What does that mean? That I have four of those and I have two of those? Well, then let's go with the porridge. How do I... <gasps> That's cute, you guys. Every single time my phone falls, I almost give you money. Huh? Well, I mean, sure. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> munch, munch. Um, can I have some more, please? Yes, you may. Of course. Chomp, chomp. If you hungry, you hungry. Okay, so now it's nighttime. Mm. Right? Are we done? It's really late now. Even the sun's gone to bed. So sleepy must be bedtime. So it's time for Klaus to go to bed. Reading a bedtime story, patting Klaus will increase his comfort, of course. You guys, bedtime is such a, like, the longest routine ever here for my son. He needs, like, ten hugs and back rubs and a book and a song and a cuddle and a snuggle and ten kisses again and... <laughs> Alright, let's go to sleep. Um, yeah, go to bed. I want to fall asleep right now, then tomorrow we'll be here more quickly. Yeah. I'll be all grown up. I'm so excited. Oh, sweet thing. Liv got three whole presents for her birthday. How many will I get? Well, oh my oh. lord, they just followed you, dude. <laughs> you are a stalker, man. It's so cool. Set up the studio in the house. Good morning. How are you? How are you? You guys, this is the studio um, which created the game. Let's give a big old welcome to you, them. Hi. Hi, pipe, pipe for Sarepta in the house. I'm very excited to watch you play. Oh my gosh. If you, my heart, I'm nervous now. <laughs> Stupid neighborhood, what happened, Toki? Did I miss something? Oh, the cat, that's right. Yes, 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 I agree. Liv got three whole presents for her birthday. How many will I get? Oh, man. Oh, that's so important to them, isn't it? You'll get some nice presents, too. Don't you worry. Three presents sounds like Liv likes to tell tales. No, no, no. We're not going to say that their, their friend lies. We should be grateful for what we have. Mmm. Ooh. What would I say? I think I would say, like, you'll get some nice presents, too. Yeah, the, don't you remember the letter at the beginning? It said that the cat that was eating the flowers needs to be, like, kept inside. No, let the cat eat the flowers. Set up the studio has won five from the jump catch game. The little avatars aren't even out. <laughs> I have the little studio avatars on my just chatting scene on, on this one. Um... And little stars fall and you can jump and interact, but I took I don't have them on the game scene, so that's that's why it says that you won five from the catch game. <laughs> I didn't want to distract from the game today. Or any game, so I'm not I don't think I'm gonna have them on the on the on the game scenes. Yay! Oh I can't wait. Okay. Uh how about you just focus on having fun, yeah? We're going to have a lot of fun, I promise. Oh, promises. You know what? We're going to make his day really fun. See you tomorrow. Unless, unless, like, they purposely made it so that it's going to be hard to have fun. The mail documents and pictures that you collect can be found in the study. Okay. Oh, sweet thing. Good night. Mm, 
What do I do? Do I click on that? Okay. Right? Letters and newspapers will gather over time. Reading many in one sitting will only cost one unit of time. Okay. Oh, it's gonna be like bills and stuff and whatnot, huh? Man. Do I have to push one? That's very kind of you. Click on the mail icon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but now what? But I don't have any time. Okay. Dang. So, do I go to bed myself? Ending the day. Okay, when you're ready to end the day, go to the closest bedroom and tap the lamp to turn off the light. Okay. I think you gotta sleep during the night. Makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> Mm, good, good morning. Wake up Klaus by washing his face. Go to the bathroom sink. This is fast and does not time. Okay, nice. Um, let's do that. Let's wash your little face. Good morning and happy birthday. Washy, 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 washy. It's my birthday. It's my birthday. I barely slept all night. I'm seven years old now. Do I look different? Yes, let's see. Is that you? I almost didn't recognize you. Yes. <laughs> we gotta have... My son is so caught up on that, like, how many years... Oh, how old am I? How many months am I? And we told him, I think my husband, like, Googled it, and he's like, 63 months, and he goes around saying, I'm 63 months. And he's just so excited. <laughs> well, oh my lord, they just followed you, dude. <laughs> you are the a stalker man. man is so cool. Anna, 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 thank you so much for coming in today. Thank you, thank you. Hopefully you'll enjoy the narrative as well, or cry about it, since that's what we do. I mean, I, I, it won't be the first time I cry on stream. Um, and we do have some, some game dev students here in chat as well. Uh, Meat Bun just turned in her game for her class. Um, she's studying to do game narrative as well. So it's really exciting, really exciting, not only for me. So I'm looking forward to it. It looks wonderful so far. <laughs> Liv was supposed to send me a birthday letter. Can we go see? Okay, let's go see. Um, happy birthday. Sorry I can't be there. Can't wait for school to start so we can hang out every day. You're the best, Liv. I touched a troll today or yesterday. That's cute. <laughs> it's a letter from Liv. She really saw a troll. I wish I could play with Liv today and every day, but she's visiting her aunt in Jotunheimen. Uh, we are here just for the tears. <laughs> yes, we are doing a Ask Me Anything Today at 5 on the My Child Discord. Um, you guys, if you guys want to learn more about it, uh, please follow uh, My Child's community Discord server at the link mentioned here in chat. Um, they will be holding an Ask Me Anything. Any questions that you have for the studio, you can go ahead and ask them there today at 5 p.m. Central Eastern, uh, Central European time. Okay, so she's visiting her aunt. Oh, we can open the gift now. Liv's present. I nearly forgot. I can open it now, right? Yes, 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 you can. Go for it. A ball, my very own ball. Can we play with it now? Hmm, don't we have school? Tap to throw the ball to Klaus. Playing with Klaus costs the time unit. Okay. For the birthday boy, of course. Yes, yes, yes. It's his birthday. It's his birthday. Streamer tears is what we live for. Man, you guys do make me cry. Of course, let him play. Nice. Um, do I throw it? Oh, that's very cute. <laughs> so what should we do now? Spare moments. Decide how to spend your day. You only have seven time units per day. Divided over four time periods. Okay. Manage the household and care for the child. Oof. Okay. That is stressful enough as it is. I love how I send my real life kids to daycare to take care of another kid in game. <laughs> Don't forget to pay the bills before nighttime. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you guys are on it. Okay, 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 okay. I don't think there's any... That's right. Okay. We have to check. Oh. This is how we scan the news. Okay. 
In the news, national egg production is in decline. There aren't much egg or there aren't enough eggs for the export market for what is now the second week in a row. Debate continues on whether Norwegian officials should stop exporting this essential item. The income is greatly needed, but so too is the produce itself. All right. What is that? Stop. Baby pictures, man. Oh. Three, four, five. That's when he turned six. Okay. It's very cute with the Norwegian decorations on the tree and whatnot. I love it. I really love it. Cool animation and with the ball. Yeah, right? <laughs> okay. Um, we need to feed him. You know, about my birthday. Oh, God. Is he going to ask for cake like you guys do? Oh, he did. <laughs> Why is my, my chat is obsessed with cake? Liv said her mom made a cake for her. Do you think, could could I have one? I really like cake. And I love baking cake, so of course. Are you sure you don't want cabbage instead? What? No, of course. I'll make you a fresh cake right away. Maybe we can bake one together if you're a good boy. No, don't, don't, don't. No. We'll make him a cake. I want a soft, mushy cake. Feed him some Norwegian tacos. <laughs> there is no birthday without cake. That is true. I want a soft, mushy cake. Ooh, I can't wait. Tap on the window to get outside. There you can find the store and other areas. Okay. Oh, that window. <laughs> Went to push the real window. Oh no, wait. Yeah, I do have to push the real window. Okay. Um. Yeah, I have money. Mm, and then go back home. Did you get the cake stuff? It's okay. I'll be fine alone here. All right, let's go make some cake. Ah, yo, Oscar. Tu y tu pastel. You and your cake. <laughs> They've been wanting cake since I had my uh, one month affiliate stream last week. They asked why I wasn't celebrating with cake. And ever since then, they keep asking for cake. <laughs> I feel like something bad is going to happen because it makes you want to do everything for the kid and forget response. I know, Swish. I know. And for those that don't know, Swish is my husband. Um... He's tuning in from the doctor's office. Um, and I, I know, I know. I had, Obviously, if there's expected tears, something's going to happen. And I just want to do everything for this kid right now. Did you get the cake stuff? It's okay. I'll be fine alone here. All right. Let's go make the cake. How do I make the cake? There we go. Uh, what do we do? I click on you. Still waiting for the cab. Okay. All right. So, yeah, so you're done. So you're going to be on your way home then soon. We got to get the husband to play as well then. He'll be tuning in. He'll be tuning in. Definitely. Oh, you have to show the cake magic you make. I did. So um, I have posted the cakes that I make because I have... I, I make cakes, not not for like a living or anything, but more hobby and whatnot for my kids. Uh, in my Discord channel, uh, there is a I Made Something channel. Um, and I have shared some of the cakes and other people share their amazing abilities and skills and whatnot. All right, let's see. Uh, wait. Okay, how do we make the... Why does it make me want to go outside? Don't I have to make the cake? No! I'm confused. Didn't I buy the cake stuff? I don't think you bought the thing. Oh no, I didn't buy the thing? Okay. Oh, I did not buy the thing. Yeah, I still have 200. That makes sense. Okay, all right, I got it. Thank you, thank you, Meepun. Oh no! I was playing with puddles and I got messy. Oh, that's gonna take a time slot. Okay, yeah. What would I do in real life? I'm trying to think. I'd have to bathe him first, and then we'll make the cake after. But then he's also going to get dirty from making the cake. So, hmm. Oh, but he's wet and icky. Dang it. Okay. Change your clothes costs a unit of time. Yeah. Oh. This feels so much better. Gotta press on the cashier. Yeah. 
That little town looks like Trondheim. <laughs> um, we'll set up that you guys are located in a uh, hub mod, right? How far is that from Trondheim? The sandwich cake is fudging awesome, but we mostly eat it during midsummer. Sandwich cake? Oh, is that that thing that Mr. Fox? Yeah, that's the thing that Mr. Fox sent me a picture of. We are in Hamad, pretty far from Trondheim. <laughs> this looks so much better. Be more careful next time. You needn't have worried so much. Clothes get mucky sometimes. It's okay. It does. Phew, that's good to know. So is it nearly time to bake the cake? I mean, you gotta let kids be kids, right? Like, getting dirty isn't the end of the world. Throwing a load to wash, you're gonna throw the load to wash anyways. Just, if it's one more shirt. We, we try not to be, Swish and I try not to be so strict when it comes to things like that. We just want... Their childhood is important. Just let them play. Let them jump in puddles. Let them make a mess. It's fine. To make food for Klaus, go to the kitchen counter. Okay. There we go. We got the cake stuff. I'm so excited. I've never helped to bake a cake before. Cooking is easy. Just have the ingredients each time that you cook. Costs of unit of time. All right. Oh. I like the effect. Nice. We made pad cakes with my son. <laughs> there was a lot of eggshells in them. <laughs> Bless him. But he was so keen on cracking those eggs. That was really fun. Time for my birthday party. Oh, I hope we have friends. Okay. But you have to eat. Is that your breakfast? Oh, okay. Oh, well. It's Okay, I'm not gonna lie. I let my kid have birthday cake for his, uh, for his breakfast as well. That's fine. That was really tasty. I like cake. Your cake is the best I've had. Oh, sweet boy. Of course I got you a present. Trondheim? Trondheim? I've been to Trondheim. Oscar and I have been to Trondheim. We, um... We went together with our Mexican folkloric dance group to perform at a Day of the Dead event that they held at the library there. Um, it was really nice. A lot. It is smaller than Bergen, but it was a nice town. Very flat. A lot flatter than Bergen. Drawing pencils. You remembered what I wanted. Thank you. You're welcome, Klaus. And guess what? You can use them when you start school next week. Just remember they were expensive. Be careful with them. No, you don't tell the kids that. Hmm. Is he going to be sad that he starts school next week, or is that going to be excited? I know my kid would be excited. Because that means he's a big boy. Yeah, okay, he's excited. Thank you so much for my present. I love it. A new entry has been added to the photo album. Let's try them now. You can help color in my drawing. Go to my room and draw. Let's go! Oh, oh that's cute. And there's a Norwegian flag. That was fun. I love my new pencils. Can I stay up a little longer, please? I just don't want my birthday to end. I think someone needs their bed. You could stay up, but if you sleep, you might grow even more. <laughs> then my kid would definitely want to stay awake. Uh, no, it's time for bed now. He looks tired. I think someone needs their bed. I'm not even tired. I can stay up, see? <laughs> so typical, so typical. But he's still hungry. Hmm. Arevia, good morning, hon. How are you? How are you? Thanks for tuning in today. We're playing a we're playing a Norwegian game today, actually. Uh, it's called My Child Lebensborn. It's a nurture-based game. We're an adoptive parent to this to this uh, to this child. Uh, good night, Klaus. Did you- No, let's ask if he had a nice birthday. I really did. Thank you. We had so much fun. I just wish- Uh, I just wish Lyft could have been here, though. That's understandable. Do you think I'll get any more presents? We'll just have to wait and see. You should be happy with what you already got. Mm, probably not, little one. I like that one. It has the same style as Spirit Fair, it looks like. I tried that for the first time the other day. Uh, he looks sad. He's tired. He's tired, Oscar. Oh, that's okay. Wait, little? I'm grown up now. Oh, no. Dang. Yeah. Dang it. Would you read me a bedtime story? Man, our words 
We have to always watch our words around kids, man. It's true. No, not tonight. Maybe tomorrow. It's too late for a story now. Sure, anything for you. Oh, you guys. We have to be parents, though. We have to be strict. It's birthday time. I mean, it's it's bedtime. But also, it's his birthday. Having a good stream. Yes, Godly Caster. Hi. So far, so good. Yes, of course. It's his birthday. Oh, meat bun. Okay, but uh, oh, let him have a story. But then you may let him think that this can happen every single night. And then we get to the point, like the point that I am with my son, where he needs two stories and a hug and a kiss and a song and a dance and... <laughs> Have the book until Klaus falls asleep. Reading costs one time unit. We got we got chores to do. When when we put the kids to sleep, it's when we got the chores to do. The stream begging for a story on behalf of the child. I know, I know, I love it. Birthdays are overrated. One more year, yay. Only one story. Okay, guys. Okay, okay. Story. We we yeah. It's his birthday. Yes. I love that effect. Him just taking in the fantasy. That is really cute. Oh, bless him. He's asleep. Okay. Let's go. Okay. No letters today. Do I have any chores to do? Do I bathe? Do I do self-care myself? No. Okay. So let's... No. Oh, I think I have to go here. No. There we go. All right. Let's start a new day. Uh, but story time on the bed is fun. It is. It is. I, I, we read to ours as well. The stream bag. Uh, so true. We are on three books and five songs with mine. <laughs> Anna. Oh, Alina's too cute. Um, Anna is my in real life friend. I am the godmother to her daughter, and uh, it was her her son's baptism that I was at yesterday. Good morning. I'm ready for today. Ooh, child, you are very very dirty, and you are very hungry. Okay, school starts on Tuesday. It sure does. Are you excited? That's right. Do you feel ready? Correct. You'll do great. Let's not worry him with do you, do you feel ready. Let's just see how he feels. Just one more day. I can barely wait. Okay. Um, I want to feed you first because kids tend to get dirty when they eat and then we can bathe later. Yum yum. Could we have some different food soon? We eat this a lot. I miss having warm dinners. That's warm. So do I. I'll get a job soon and then maybe you'll get better food. To buy better food, I need a job. I'm trying to find one. I know I'll get a great job and we can buy loads of food. You'll see. We don't need to worry them with the specifics. Let's... Oh, God, why is talking to kids so hard sometimes? There are jobs to apply for. Go to the study and look through the newspaper. Are you still hungry? You're still hungry. Let's eat this. He got really dirty from sleeping, I know. <laughs> I need to wash those bed sheets. <laughs> munch, munch. All right, one more... Oh man, we're gonna be running out of food though. I think I only had two breads. Yeah. Let's get him just... I have 140. Okay, he's good for now. Where are his boy... Where are this boy's parents? Okay, so Oscar, so this is based on... Um, if you missed it, this is based on the children uh, during the World War II... Um, okay. So the reason it's called My Child Lebensborn is because these kids were born of the German soldiers that came and invaded Norway, uh, mostly to Norwegian women mothers. Um, it was a Nazi-initiated mission program to try to create the perfect children. And these children were then, you know, later on adopted uh, out without ever having met their parents, um, just to kind of sort of like what, what was like Hitler's thing like clean the, the the people or something that was like his mission to create the perfect blonde hair blue-eyed children and whatnot so that's the story of these children that they're the result of this nazi program just pretty much bred for his his own purposes for you know the nazi's main mission um and that's why he doesn't have parents that's why we're 
we're the adoptive parent of this little boy. Save time for the baby. Be right back. No worries, Chip. You put the little baby to sleep. No worries. You go take care of the, the real baby. I'll take care of this, this baby. <laughs> okay, now we gotta wash him. The woman got deported and kids got given away. Yeah, kids got just given away. That's so sad. And I was talking with my, <clears throat> I was talking with my in-laws yesterday. Um, okay, so I, I'm from the States and not to go too much into the American school system, uh, but we didn't really learn all of this in detail about the war. We learned about World War II, but not in detail that specifically per country coming here and then to Norway you know it's it's a lot closer when I was there it was far away it's what happened in Europe but then being in Europe it's very different and like it made me click it, it was just it hit a little different yesterday when I was talking with my father-in-law because Bergen is one of the cities that the German came to invade um, and I'm on an island just outside of of Bergen which was used by the soldiers there's bunkers on the island where i live we take our kids to go bike there there are missiles and tanks and everything still left behind stretch. Stretch. thank you so much for the for the stretch thank you from my balcony i can see across to the other island on top of the mountain fjellfesting it's called um that was also a, a base that overlooked the ocean for incoming ships the 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 fjords where i i live that come into bergen there are uh, I realize there are torpedo bases that they use to protect from invade uh, invasions. Like, it just hits so different when you're finally here and realizing it's sitting on my balcony enjoying coffee and waffles. I'm looking out and seeing these, these, I guess you can call them like fossils of war. Uh, it's just mind blowing. Though we will get some insight on the mother's perspective as they were shunned from society because of their experience and these Germans with these German soldiers, it is learned that some of these women were just young, naive, and in love without any ulterior motive, but they had to be put in a situation where they had to see these kids as mistakes. That's horrible. Even though the child had no connection with the war, they were innocent. My grandmother and her brother got adopted away due to lack of resources. Jesus. Yeah, so it just hits a little different when, when you're finally here coming from you know from the states all right since it's sunday today how about we can go explore the forest let's 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 watch this little dude you don't have to always buy things we can find food too which is good since the store is always closed on sundays now we have sunday stores new area unlocked outside forest and lake oh but we're gonna get dirty again huh no but we're not gonna go exploring we're gonna we're not gonna go exploring all dirty that is, that's horrible, Mr. Fox. Um, also my, uh, some friends of, of the family, some friends of my father, my in-laws, um, he was telling me that one of their fathers was actually caught, uh, in prison, or he was caught just down here, uh, on the island in the, in the forest here, and then was taken to, I'm pointing like you guys know where I'm talking about, but... I can see it. I can see it from my balcony. I'm saying he was caught down down there by the, in the forest um, and was uh, taken to a war camp. Uh, and he did escape. He was 18 at the time and he escaped later on. And then, yeah, so it's just here on the island where I live. It's just, it's crazy to know that that history is here. All right, let's go to the forest, you guys. Good news is that after this game, Norwegian government apologized from Levenborn's children for this type of discrimination, if I remember correctly. That's big. That's big. That's amazing, you guys. Wow. That's amazing. Yes, good. That's very good to hear. Thank you for making an impact with your game. Yeah, really, really. That's amazing. Oh, look, so many things to pick. Um. Oh, blueberries. Yes, we have food. You can't hide from us, little berries. All right, blueberries. I didn't think we'd find any. Where are the trolls? Should we find that? Is that all we're gonna do? Okay. Oh, what? that's... Uh, I can tickle him! Oh, sweet baby boy. Okay. Mm, can I go anywhere? No. I guess we go home. You're hungry again! Oh, yes we are. Okay. 
I hope that I can create such games as well once I join the game industry properly. You will, Meat Bun. You will. You need to look for a job in the game. Remember before bed. Okay, Meat Bun. Yes. Uh, let's go to the studio. We got nice. Thank you. We need more workers at the old factory. Steady job from Monday to Saturday. That's a lot of days. I read your ad for factory work and hereby wish to apply. I am a hard worker who would be very grateful for a steady job. Please consider me for your position. Okay. Let's see what that new picture was. There was a new picture added. Oh, he went this pencils. Very cute. Uh, we need to feed him dinner. Oh, he's tired. He doesn't. Okay. Okay. No, no dinner. No bedtime story today? So I was drawing today and I had an idea. I can help us earn money. We can sell my drawings. <gasps> precious, precious baby. That's a great idea. We'll work hard, both of us together. You shouldn't think about such things. That's my job as a grown-up. That's sweet. All I need you to do is keep being nice. Um... <clears throat> Okay, so from personal experience with kids, I, I know that they like to feel like they're in on it together with, with us on certain things. Um, this is... But it is my job as a grown-up, but they always want to help. I will buy more food. I'll buy more food tomorrow. Yeah, capitalist kid. That's sweet. All I need you to do is to keep being nice. Um, but I don't want him to sell his drawings. But I know that he wants to help. Oh my god, what should we do, guys? What should we do? We'll work hard, both of us together. You shouldn't think about such things. That's my job as a grown-up. That kind of makes him think, though, that this is, like, very serious, though. I don't want him to worry. That's sweet. All I need you to do is... I kind of like the last one. Should we do the last one? We need the money, mama. <laughs> no, 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 no. We don't need to... Sell them. Oh, Scott. No. Oh, Scott. <laughs> Keep being nice. Okay. Two. You got you got beat, Oscar. <laughs> hey, I'm not a little kid any Oh Jesus with the little kid. Oh man, okay. Oh I can I do that all the time with my own son. Could you read me a bedtime story? You know what? Oh, but that costs time. Mm. How many I only have one left. I already paid the bills. That time story. Fourth option, you're so kind and sweet, but I want to keep your amazing drawings for myself. Yes, I like that one. I like that meat bun. Let's give him a bedtime story. Why would he say thank you? Oh, I like that. Oh, sweet thing. Go to sleep, child. Dream sweet dreams. Okay. Yep, nothing left, and there's nothing for me to do after he's asleep. Um, okay. It's kind of what I expect, though. I kind of expect there to be things that I have to do in the house, like cleaning or whatnot, um, picking up toys, washing the clothes. Um, but okay. August 20th. Okay. He starts school on... Does he start school today? Or Tuesday? Liv is back today. She said I could go and play with her at noon. <clears throat> Yay! We got the job. We got the job, guys. We are happy to offer you a job at our factory. Please start at your earliest convenience from August 21st. Ooh. We asked our artist where the environment was based on. It is apparently a general imagination of northern Norway. Ah, well, see? So, uh, Oscar was a little right with it being, saying it was kind of Trondheimish, or unless he means, like, super, super, super north. Um. <clears throat> okay. What does it say? 
Good news, I just got a job at the factory. I got a job which is good, but I'm going to start being away during the day. I'm going to start a new job. I'll be able to provide for us. Um, let's just let's just keep it. That's great. When do I get to have a job? Yes, I thought. Though I think he based it on where he is from, and it's a bit further north than Trondheim. Yeah, Trondheim is a little bit more middle, I think. When do I get to have a job? Not just yet. You can get a job when you're a bit older. Jobs are for grown-ups. You focus on having fun, okay? Just focus on doing well in school. Then you can get a job after. Um. Okay, jobs are not just for grown-ups, so I had a job as a teenager. Okay, I'll do really well at school. I'll be the best in my class. Yes. Okay, I gotta feed you. You are hungry. Buy food first, then feed, little boy. Uh... Yes, he did want some other food. Fish. No. Green, which is grain. It's not Vietnam now. Uh, okay, let's buy this. Let's buy that. Wait, we don't need two fishes. Uh, let's buy more bread. Let's do that. Even Bruno's today. <laughs> Uh, okay. Let's go back home. How did he get dirty? He wasn't dirty. Leave him alone for one second. Oh, uh, I need to make whatever this is. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We can have... Maybe we can have a bread with jam or something. What is this? Oh, is it gonna be soft? Oh, yay! We made something else. That's a nice breakfast. That's a nice breakfast. We can do that. Okay. He was dirty. Yeah, he was. You leave him alone for one second and then they're all dirty. Um, yeah, you said you might fix some of my old clothes soon. They're nice. I like them except for the holes. Holes are no good. Boy, you are in luck. This mama is a seamstress as well. All right, I got you. Liv and I are going to play in the forest. Bye. You can craft and mend items in your spare time. Visit the kitchen table. See, now we got now we got the extra chores now. Okay. Uh, did he just he just left? Okay, let's fix his clothes. Um. Okay. So. I would have done a better job, but okay. How do kids get dirty? Turn your back on them. <laughs> yeah. Again? He's even more dirty. I'm back. I had so much fun with Liv. And you're hungry again. Okay. Um, let's go make you some more food. Let's make some more. Let's make let's make this. Let's give you let's give you a lunch. A good lunch. A warm lunch. Nice. Maria Skensa. Yes, there we go. We can make it. Let's just make everything. Okay. All right, let's go eat, little one. Um, okay, yawn. Oh, wait. I have to feed you. Can I? You need to eat. You need to eat a nice warm meal. Oh, that didn't really get him super hungry. Um... Oh man, I'm wasting all the food. Okay. Your belly is a little... You'll hold. You'll hold till morning. Oh, you're so tired, little one. No! Oh no. Okay. Well, being dirty doesn't hurt. Better to ha Better to not be hungry. Oh man. Yeah. Too late. The day passes quick here. Yeah. When I wake up, I will be a schoolboy. I wonder what it'll be like at school. You seem a little nervous. Are you looking forward to it? It's going to be so much fun. Just remember to be nice. Stop worrying. You'll do great. See, I already know where this game is going because I know what it's based on and I already know that he's going to have to deal with some bad things at school. Um, and as a mom, you're always worried about that. I'm worried about that for my kids too, you know, being... You know, half Mexican, half Norwegian. 
I mean, it's not it's not the same nowadays so much, but there's still always always bullies at school. But I do worry that him being a little different may affect him. And I say he because one child looks very Norwegian while the other one looks more like me. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Just gotta, we just gotta do our best. We have to do our best as parents. Oh, man. This is getting too close to home. You seem a little nervous. Are you looking forward to it? It's going to be so much fun. Just remember to be nice. Stop worrying. You'll do great. I mean, he's not going to stop worrying. Um... Dang, Meat Bun, you catch on to all, everything. Okay, I'll go look at the clothes tomorrow, too. I'll be nice to everyone. Work hard and you'll do great. And look, if anyone's mean to you, just ignore them. Just be a good boy and you'll be fine. I, I, I'm going to say work hard and you'll do great. You're probably right. I'll work hard, I promise. Focus on yourself right now, little one. A story before sleep would be nice. Do you have time? Oh, I don't have time anymore. It's too late, Klaus. It's past your bedtime. No, maybe tomorrow. We're going to say it's past your bedtime. Got to keep the routine. Oh, good night then. I don't have any more time for anything else. It is. That's true. That's true, my bun. Glad you're here. Today is a day. Okay, first off, feed and... Okay, so feed you and bait. You can't go to school like that. Like a big boy. So how about we get ready for your big day? Are you excited? That's right. You're going up so fast. Mm, we Let's ask how we get ready for your big day. I'm almost ready to go. <laughs> you need a shower. Oh, and it's your first day at your new job too. Aw, you remembered. Maybe soon we can afford a nice backpack to carry my school books. I think I saw one in the shop. We will see, but you have to do well at school. No, we're not going to base it off of him. I'll try to get you one, but I have to see if I can afford it first. Now, that sounds like a great idea. Okay, I, I, we, we, I think we can all agree that the last one is the best choice. Yay, I'm going to get it back back. Oh, man. Okay, I said we'll see. <laughs> no, we'll get him a backpack. That's what I... I yeah, I just want to give him a hug. Swish and I also, we prioritize... I mean, we have to prioritize our kids. We have to prioritize our bills, for sure, because responsibilities, but our kids. Bathe. Bathe you. Get in there. Get in there. Don't make him a spoiled kid. Necessities are one thing, though. That's very different. He needs a school backpack to carry his books. Okay. Um, oh, uh, let's do, let's do this one. I'm going to need to buy more food. Um, I just don't like that it's yellow. I feel like he's hungry. But remember, base your decisions on how those times were. You're dirt poor there. Oh, I know. I mean, I'm dirt poor now, too. <laughs> she says with the new PC setup. Uh, I'm nervous. Do you think you could walk me to school? Yes! Oh, man. Okay. I'm sorry, Klaus. I can't be late for work. Ah. Don't be nervous, Klaus. You'll do great. I don't think I can, but how about we walk some way together? Yes! I like... Okay. Yeah, that one. Right? Or am I going to be late? Am I going to be late? Oh, but see? Oh, he's... Mm. To send Klaus to school, go outside and tap on the red building. School lasts until the afternoon. All right. Thank you for walking me here. The school is really big, isn't it? Be strong and be confident. Show everyone how smart you are. If anyone gives you trouble, you'll tell a teacher, yes? Just be nice and polite. Everyone will think you're great. See, but I say everything. <clears throat> I say, oh, can I choose all of the above? I want to encourage him. Mm. Ah, swish. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. <clears throat> I need water. Okay. 
But see, I already know... I already know that he's gonna have to face some troubles. And if I tell him everyone will think you're great, and someone doesn't think, you know, gives him B for whatever, then he's not gonna feel like he's great. But, oh, but you do have to tell kids that. Oh. He has to be strong. No pain, no gain. <laughs> That's true. I true. I, I really like the first one. I think he has to be strong and confident. Being nice, just being nice all the time, too. Um, keep his head down. We have a poppy society. <laughs> but he doesn't know that. He doesn't need to know that. Oh, man, you guys are making it hard. Okay, someone else. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? It's gonna be bedtime if you don't make a decision, Sue. First one. Okay. Oh, Scott says strong. Meat Bun says strong. Fox says the last one. I like the first one. Only being nice gets you wedgies at school. Oh, Scott sounds like you went through a few things. Okay. I guess I am pretty smart. Oh, Liv is waiting for me. Bye. Okay, let's go to work. Okay, can't click overtime. Nope. I got paid. Awesome. Oh, I don't have enough for a backpack. We had food at home, though. Uh, oh, he's sleeping. Okay, so he started school. Um, he and I got a job. And so I got paid today. We have a few... We have some food at home. But he also wants a backpack. And I only have 145. You got food. I have two food. Right. It's okay for now. Save up. I agree. I feel like I need to save up. Work tomorrow. I give him one food now, one food in the morning. Work tomorrow, then I can buy the backpack and hopefully some food tomorrow. Because it looks like I got paid like 70 something. Uh, so I'll have 40 something left over ish tomorrow. I'll have enough to buy. Okay, let's go. Let's go home. Where's home? Is it this one? No, here. I don't, yeah, I don't have money for the backpack yet though. How was your first day at school? Oh man, he looks sad already. Did you behave? No, what's wrong? Mm, let's ask how his first day was. School was strange and not nice at all. Man, I knew it. I was trying to make some friends, but well, everybody kept staring at me and didn't talk to me. You haven't done anything wrong. They just don't know you. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you try talking to anyone? What? What is wrong with those kids? I mean, the last one is what I would think for sure. Um... I mean, he hasn't. You have to let him know he hasn't done anything wrong. I agree, Meat Bun. Oscar. So maybe if they get to know me, they might be nice. Oh, but you're also... Mm, you're telling him to also try harder and expose himself more so we can be friends. You said it would be fun. Oh. To me why did that get to me like it did uh, okay do we have anything to make oh good we have some more to make uh, man that made me feel bad could you help me look at my school book of course my teacher might ask someone to answer questions tomorrow uh Yes, of course. Don't worry about homework. School only just start. No, oh, no, no. I really don't have time to do that today. Mm. He, yeah, I agree. One. Thank you. The book is in my room. But he needs to eat. Bear 
Ready? Here we go. If Lynn and Pierre each had an apple and Lynn gave Pierre her apple, how many apples would Pierre have? Aw, oh, man. I didn't really pay attention to the math of it. <laughs> Who paid attention? <laughs> Can I go back? Is that what the back button is? You have to do math in the game. I know. <laughs> it was two apples? Okay, okay. Yes, that's what I thought too. Thank you. <laughs> okay, next one. Alright, you guys got this, okay? If Pierre then ate one of his apples... I like... Okay, this is where it's like... Numbers written out just doesn't work for me. I have to see them visually, like, written as a number itself. If Pierre then ate one of his apples, how many apples would he have left? Okay, I got this one, you guys. I swear I'm smart. Uh, mm -hmm. Alright, last one. I want the option where it lets him try, too. If Pierre's mom brings four more apples and she tells Pierre and Lynn to share all the apples fairly... Then how many apples should Pierre give to Lynn? Yeah, Pierre should give two and a half apples. Life was so different before we had smartphones. Yeah? Yeah, I remember that from school. It was so frustrating to try and read the math. Yeah, hi, Kathleen. Hi. It, it is very hard to read the math. I need to see, I need to see the numbers. Yeah, last one. What? He already had two apples from before. Even if he ate one? But then we would have five, so that wouldn't be fair. Wait, what? He had one left and she brought four, so there was five. So it would be two and a half. I think we're done. Thank you for helping me. Okay, we have time to eat. Good. Percy says... <laughs> Okay, chomp chomp. Oh, you're very hungry. I guess if this will be a school game, I guess it's always the person who plays that answers and never the kid. Mm. What do you mean, Anna? I There is an ad uh, adapted version for school, and um, it does come with its own curriculum. I haven't... I don't know what that curriculum uh, is, but... Uh, ooh. Hold on, my leg is like stuck in my blanket. But then he ate one and she had eaten none. Trick question. Oh, dang. Man. Okay, maybe I'm not smart. <laughs> Kath is the CEO of Sarif that's sneaking in. Oh, wow. Okay, no pressure. No pressure. Good morning. Shh. <laughs> Okay, so he ate some. He's still very hungry. I still have... I'm so tired after today. I can't feed him anymore, though. Okay. That time. It just bothers me that it's in yellow. It bothers me that it's in yellow. I want to feed him more, but... Mm. I'm not sure I like school. Even the teacher, Miss Hansen, seemed kind of mean. Ooh. You'll work harder than everyone and earn their respect. Growing up means learning from the challenges you face it'll get better i'm sure of it i can't okay so based on what happened the day before i l said that he was gonna have fun and he trusted me less i have to behave now there are ceos in the chat yes oscar you have to behave <laughs> um well, oh my lord, they just followed you, dude. <laughs> you are a stalker, man. man. It's so good. good. Thank you so much for the follow, Lizzie. Thank you so much. How are you today? Two, if you feed him, he can eat as much as he wants. Not everything took one time point every time. Yeah, but that right now I couldn't. I couldn't choose the arrows. Uh, he was too tired. So it, it locked me from feeding him more. Have a nice lurk. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Let's play him a night song. I didn't ask to, to be born, born Latina. Latina. Nomás tuve suerte. Si necesita de que te un dale. Sigue bailando, mami, no pare. That was really loud. But thank you for the Latina pride. <laughs> okay. 
Uh, what do we think? What do we think? Um, two, growing up means learning. I mean, yes, these are different times too. So, oh, okay. You're right. You're right, Mr. Fox. I think number two, maybe I've changed my mind. Maybe I don't want to be a grown up after all. Don't do it. Do not recommend. Zero out of ten. Can you, would you maybe read me a story? I have time for that, right? Or did I have to? Yeah, Toki, that was really loud. I'm so sorry for that. Um, I don't know how to adjust the volume on that. <laughs> did I have to mend the clothes? Can I go look? What does this do? Does this, I hope this doesn't take me to the main menu. No, okay. Um... I want to I want to read him a story, but I have one day slot left. Read him a story, cheer him up with a story. Okay, chat says story. Oh, sweet child. There it is. Let me just check. Oh, okay. I don't have that then, or was it here? Uh, yeah, one out of two. You are right, Meat Bun. Hmm. A, tor a story with trolls. <laughs> Stories for CT Weekends. Alright, we're gonna have to finish mending that. Alright. Let's, let's go to the next day. We get the rest of our books soon. Oh, he's going to ask for the backpack. He's going to ask for the backpack. Ah, oh, I don't have the backpack, though. The other kids have backpacks for their books. There are much more important things we need to spend money on. No, we don't say that. I'm not sure if we can afford a backpack close. <laughs> oh, dang it! Swish! No banks today. I thought I'd disable that. Swish! That's my husband, you guys. <laughs> I told him to behave today. Ah. <laughs> oh. The other kids have backpacks for their books. Such a troll. Such a troll, Swish. Mean husband. There are much more important things we need to spend money on. I'm not sure if we can afford a backpack, Klaus. As it happens, um, I might be getting you a backpack very soon. Oh, something's going to happen. Something's going to make me spend money, and I'm not going to be able to get him a backpack. Um, But... I caught myself in real life the other day saying something like about money and whatnot. Like my son asked me why we don't have a Jaguar. And like my first response was like, mommy doesn't have money for a Jaguar. And uh, Swish was like, don't say that. And that's true. You shouldn't be saying stuff like that. Um, two. Yeah, I think it's it, it helps to be honest. My dictionary is going off. Didn't mean CT. Oh, okay. What? <laughs> We'll do an AMA later today, actually. Yes, I did. I did announce that we, uh, for those that were just coming in, we are, or not we are, they are the community. The My Child uh, community is having a Ask Me Anything later today at 5 p.m. If you guys want to learn more, be able to ask the studio any questions that you guys have, go ahead and follow that link in the chat right now. Uh, and you'll be automatically in the Discord server. And uh, yeah, it'll be really fun if we could ask all our questions to them later today. You want him to trust you. I know. I know. Thank you. Of course. Of course. Definitely. Uh, okay. Let's be honest. Oh, that's not fair. Nope. I know. I know it isn't. I know. Oh, sorry, Meepun. Mail, mail. Let's feed you. Um, Let's feed you this. Munch, munch. Okay. Now I can feed him more. Now we are officially out of food. Okay. Give him kisses. I know the baby woke up and still tired. Oh no, Chip. Oh, that's tough with the little one. Uh, Do I have to send him to school? No, we have to shower him. We can't send him to school like that. We can't send him to school like that. I'm going to be late, aren't I? I'm going to be late. Oh, gee. I'm not sure that I want to go. 
that I have to go or Liv will be on her own. Maybe the kids would be nicer if I was like them and had a backpack. The other kids all have one. Say no to getting a backpack. Say yes to getting a backpack. Say you're not sure about getting a backpack. Mm, I can't get a backpack. I'm going to have to say I'm not sure. Can I get one? Maybe, but only to protect your books. The backpack isn't used to prove your worth. I like that. Uh, maybe, but it probably won't make the other kids any nicer. Oh, Jesus, that's right. Mr. Fox, I could use the washing tray. Oh, I can pet his head. Oh, I'm going to try that right now. Um, I'm going to try that. I'll see what I can do. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see what I can do. Kids, school is important. School is the basic foundation of knowledge being imparted to a child with or without a backpack. Very true. Um, but I'm going to... I think I'll see what I can do. Or... No, I like... I like the... Mm, should we do number one? I think I think number one is nice because he's he's already like harshly comparing himself to everybody else. Yeah, he does want to fit in. Swish. Swish language. Um. Uh, I think yeah yeah. Okay. One second. Uh, yeah, I have to push outside. Wash face and go. I did wash his face. Or I bathe him. I, I used a point. I, I'm gonna be late, aren't I? Oh, still, I was good. Oh, good, 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 good. Okay. Alright, let's get home. We have money now. We need to buy food. Oh, good, good, good. Okay. Oh, but I only have enough for one. He's gonna be super hungry now. No money. Dang it. Alright. My mom will send me with my books inside a Ramatusen bag. <laughs> a Rama, uh, Ramatusen, for those that aren't in Norway, is a grocery store here. So he means, like, with the grocery store bag. <laughs> no matter... No, I mean, no matter backpack or not. Yeah. Kids are cruel, but again, but again that's how they learn how not to be also. Yeah, I mean, they either learn how not to be, or they adopt the same behaviors. I mean, you never know. You never know. You just have to try your best, try right, to show them what's right and what's wrong. Oh, boy. Okay. He looks really sad again, but somebody called me a bad word today. They said I'm a bastard because I don't have a real family. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Okay, we're not going to say that our family is far better than theirs. No, that's unkind of them. Our family is a little different, but different isn't bad. I like that. That's wrong on many levels. We're a wonderful family. I think we can all agree, number two, our family is a little different. But being different isn't bad. And that's very true. It's okay to be different. We're all different. No matter what. Naturally, we all are different from each other. I think that's what makes each one of us unique. Two. I agree. But I don't want to be different. I'm sorry. I like our family. But they all have a mom and a dad. No one got... Oh, no one got left behind. Who are my parents? I want to know. You promised me. Oh, no, he's mad. You said you tell me now it's big, and look, I'm big now. Why would they call me a bastard? Oh, my mom heart is breaking right now. <laughs> you guys know I'm an emotional mess all the time. Um, mm, one. Thank God. I think it's going to become a thing. I cry on every stream now. <laughs> okay. 
But that's no reason to pick on you. But that doesn't matter. That doesn't change who you are. Mm. <laughs> uh, but that doesn't make you any less wonderful to me. Dude, ever since becoming a mom... And, and for Swish, a dad. I think he can... Yeah, damn it. I think Swish is probably tearing up too. Um... Oof. It's hard being a parent. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Stop cutting onions, man. I wish I knew more about my parents. Please tell me. Lots of hugs. Thank you. I like number two. I think it's it's important to be honest. Um, obviously, I'm not in the same situation, um, but I think it's important to be honest uh, and prepare them for the unpleasant things in life as well. Um, that was good. <laughs> Promise, promise that you'll find out. Hey, you subscribed. Does it feel good? Bunny! Bunny, thank you so much for the subscription, hun. How are you today? How was your stream? I saw that you were live earlier. Thank you so much. I never knew my father, so I know that feeling. Chip, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for that. I'm sorry to hear that. Loads of praise to your writers. They pull hard on the heartstrings with such few words. Yeah. I'm still crying. Ugh. And the subtle animation and expressions, they tell so much about how little boy how the little boy feels. Yeah, they do. His little just his little stomp and whatnot. Ugh. Ugh, man. Bunny, thank you so much for the subscription, you guys. Woo! That should update. We should be at 44. We are 6 off from 50, you guys. Wow. Wow. Amazing. Promise me that you'll find my doubt. Close. I promise I'll try. I promise I'll try. I promise I'll try. I fi I'll finally know who my parents are. Oh, I said I'll try. Contact Klaus's biological mother. Oh, okay. I can do that. What's that? Hmm. It's a surprise. Guess I got you something. <laughs> it's okay. These, yeah, my community is amazing. Um, even though I do play like fun, scary games, and you know, sometimes it's just laughs and giggles, we do touch on important issues and topics sometimes, and I really appreciate them a lot. Oh my god, my eyes are blurry. <laughs> okay it's a surprise and a lot of a lot of them are here in norway and in sweden so a lot of this is very close to them um it's definitely an important lesson we're learning here today just as just as important at these times yeah i agree definitely agree okay let's tell him that it's uh Oh, Scott, what are you doing? Thank you. You gifted a sub to T2 2 Mom. Thank you, Oh, Scott. Oh, you're amazing. Watch your ears. <laughs> Thank you. Muchas gracias, Oscar. Muchísimas gracias. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I'll stop crying now. I can't promise that. All right, let's say, let's say, oh, why is he sad? Okay, it's a surprise. Let's get you happy, guys. Let's get you happy. Is it a backpack? It is, isn't it? It is, it is, it is. Oh. I didn't think I would get one. Oh, sweet baby boy. Thank you so much. It's perfect. Your choice softened Klaus's heart. Oh. You're welcome. You deserve it. Just be careful with it. Enjoy it. Um. You deserve it. I can't wait to show this to Liv. Man, no kids better rip his backpack or anything. Oscar, it's not a raid. Oscar. <laughs> We have to teach Oscar the Twitch vocabulary. Oh, and I can put his head, right? 
Um, and tickle him. I love that. Look at mail. Yes, look at mail. Oh man. Okay. Schema for adoption. That means um, application for adoption. Start to write the name of mother. Siri Fjellvikseim, Strangatta, uh, forty-one Skogsand. Okay. Right, mother. Dear Siri, I know I promised to leave you alone, but I have to write to you now. Klaus has started school, and what we feared is happening. He really needs to know the truth about his father. Could you please tell me more for Klaus's sake? Kind regards. Ooh. Okay. Does each letter cost a day? Advertisement. Buy your backpacks at Steenland Sport this week only. We have several colors and models handy for hiking. We also have a range of wonderful school bags. Okay, it's all one time thing. Uh, skybound conflict above Korea. 17 American F 86 jet planes and almost 60 communist MIG aircraft met in a violent battle above North Korea today. Okay. We need to feed him. We have time for a feeding. Could we do something together? Oh, man. That's going to take up a. Okay, but all my options are yes. Okay, that's a great idea. How about we draw? Sure thing. Let's play hide and seek. That's a great idea. How about we go outside? What should we do, guys? The newspaper clippings are from real newspapers we found from 1951. Oh, wow. That's a nice touch. That's a nice detail. Outside leads to food. Me bun, you're so smart. Uh, don't I push outside? Oh, I have to go here. Nice meat bun. You're right, we probably stayed out a bit too long. We had a lot of fun, though. Yeah, we had a lot of fun, though. We have time. What should I do, though, guys? Okay, he still has some food. Oh, he's going to want a bedtime. Ooh, boo boo big brain. Yeah, but yeah, Bunman big brain. Um, okay, so here's the question though. Is it are we going to have a bedtime story or are we going to finish mending the clothes? Let me let me let me see if I can He can clean the house. It's a bit messy. There's his Marius cancer. Oh wait, that didn't cut. Yo, that did cost me time. Oh boy. Okay. Oh man. School is different to what I expected. The other kids aren't as fun as I thought, but maybe learning new things will be fun. Learning is why you're there. School is complicated, but you're a smart kid. You'll do great. Don't let others distract you. Ooh. Which one should we do? Bad clothes leads to bullying. Yeah. True. Should we do two? Or three? What should we answer here? What do you guys think? I mean, yes, learning is why he's there, but, you know, making friends and learning to socialize and everything is important as well. You have to build up his confidence. I'd say three. Okay, Swish says two. Chip says three. Okay, we got more for three. Let's do that. You'll do great. Don't let the others distract you. Things will change now that I am all grown up, huh? Oh, you're still a kid. You don't have to worry about these things. Yeah, as you grow up, you get to discover the world on your own. Even as you grow, you'll always be my little boy. Anna, you sweetheart, thank you so much for the gifted sub and to set up the studio nonetheless. <laughs> That's awesome. Thank you, Anna. Oh, I love you. And kisses to little baby Oliver, too. I know Elena's at Bonahage right now at daycare. Thank you. <laughs> Cover your ears. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Oh, I love you too. Um, number three, you guys say number three, even as a, 
Even as you grow, you'll always be my little boy. But see, he gets mad every time I call him little boy. And so does my son, too. I always call him my baby. He's like, I'm not a baby. And I was like, you'll always be my baby. Even dad is grandma's baby. Is he? Yes. <laughs> Thanks for the subscription on our behalf. I think we are reaching 50 subscribers today. Hopefully, hopefully. Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Okay, but we got, you guys said three. Gross. <laughs> I, lo I love it. I'm a big now, you know I can take care of myself. I'll be here for you to take care of you, Ruffle Hair. I trust you to make your own choices. You'll always be just right to me. I like the tickle. I love the tickle. Um... One, I, yeah, I like to take care, let him know that he has someone in his, on his side. Two. I want to see happy tears again. <laughs> I'm happy, I'm happy right now. I'm happy you guys are here with me. Well, I guess you are older than me. A lot older, but I can take care of you too, sweet baby boy. I'm sorry if I made you upset. Oh, I don't need another parent, I have you. Stop! Oh, it would just be nice to know about them. You Whoa, guys came in cold. real hard with the feels. You guys really came in with the feels. It would just be nice to know about them. It's getting late, Klaus. Time for sleep. I'll see what I can find out. Now bedtime, I think. Um, let's do, let's just do two. Let's do two. Um. Oh. All right. Okay. Um, we have no time for anything else. So, can you read me that story? I like. Oh, it's past your bedtime. I think that's two nights now, isn't it? Okay, then. Good night then. Oh, see, he's now a new entry has been added to the journal. A journal for Klaus has been added to the study. Oh, okay. Let's go see. We will always be in his corner. Oh, yes, we will. And thank you for the hydrate, Oscar. See his journal. Dear Klaus, today I promised that I would find out more about your parents. Oh, okay, it's my journal. I thought it was going to be his. I thought it was going to be his for a second. And it's going to, like, tell me his feelings and that I messed up or something. Um, today I promised that I would find out more about your parents, but I don't know if I will be able to find the answers you hope for. So I'm starting this journal. I'll give it to you when you are old enough to understand. If I can't learn the story of your parents, at least you'll know I tried and you'll know more about the war and what happened afterwards. I like that idea. I like that idea of... Militant! Thank you so much for the 1,000 bits! My goodness, how are you? Good morning to you. We are playing a, a new game. Well, it's not really new, but new to PC and console. How are you today? Um... I, I like this idea of writing a journal to your kids. Oh my gosh, bits raid. Oscar, Oscar. <laughs> Hi, Militant. Okay, how do I go back? Okay. Oh, okay, so this is what I know. Three years ago... Oh, boy, we're gonna learn some stuff. All right. Three years ago, I answered an ad in the newspaper saying three-year-old child up for adoption, reference war child. Oh, like... I dearly wanted a child, as I hope you know in your heart your mother told me that your father was a German soldier and that she was only 16 and unmarried when she had you. 16. In 1944. She refused to say more. She had married a man from the resistance and made me promise to keep you away from her new life. Hmm. I'm good, my lovely. How are you? Good morning to you. I'm really good. I'm really good. We have a set up the game studio in the house in chat today and CEO of said set up the studio in the house and I'm playing their game right now. Uh, the game just launched on PC and console this past week and I will be uh, holding a raffle giveaway for the game uh, towards the end of the stream today. So it's really excited to be trying this game. It's based on real life experiences of Lebanese born children, uh, war children uh, from the war uh, back during the World War II here in Norway. So it hits really close to a lot of people in chat since we are in Norway. Um, and we play as adoptive parent of one of these, these Lebanese born uh, children, uh, which were pretty much I'm not gonna say bread, but they were they were born to sort of like um, create. It was like a not it was a Nazi mission to to create like the perfect 
the perfect humans like the blonde hair blue eyed children so um that's why a lot of these kids were then given away the mothers were deported and whatnot so that's that's what we're playing we're, we're playing uh lizzie hi oh my gosh thank you guys for coming in today um militant going well thank you trying to keep that feels at bay with the emotional roller coaster of a game I, I already cried already i did i cried already hi lizzie the game looks really good. It is. And a raid is when a streamer... Yeah, Mr. Fox. I've tried explaining. I've, I've been explaining to him. Okay, so we have... Let's continue, guys. We have no more day points left. Um, we have no money left. So we just have to start the next day. August 23rd. That's my brother's birthday. So happy, happy birthday to Eddie. <laughs> He's dirty. Okay. He's dirty and he's hungry. I hope we have food. Let's open the mail. The factory is understaffed. Due to understaffing, we will ask you to occasionally work overtime with increased compensation. Overtime work will end in the evening. That's going to take up more time of our day. Let's wash his face. Okay. That didn't cost me points, right? Okay. That's where I made the mistake the day before. Um... Let's do overtime. I think I'm, we're going to have to do overtime because we don't have... Oh. We have one porridge left. We have no food for him in the evening then. We're going to have to do... We're going to have to bust some overtime. Uh, yep. We have no more food. Okay. Alright, little one. Let's go to school. Let's tickle you real quick. And we'll pet your head. Mm, bless you. We have to give him a haircut too. He looks good. He looks good. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's see. What am I missing? Hmm. What am I missing here? We go outside, click on the school, right? Or do I? Hmm. I have no money. Change clothes. How did we change the yes true we he has his new sweater that i fit fixed nice my backpack is really nice thank you meat bun a new entry has been added to the photo album oh my god it's gonna be his his picture all ready for school i need to see that oh so cute okay all right let's go to school and now we go to work. And we're going to have to work overtime. Those pants have not been changed in a week. <laughs> I don't think I have the option to change the pants, though. I'm good. Thanks, Militant. You, sorry. Kicking ass on Apex. They're all... Nice, Lizzie. Nice. I suck at Apex. Overtime. Let's do it. Man. Oh, we're only going to have time for maybe a feed and maybe a bedtime story. No, we don't have time for a bedtime story again. Oh, no. So up here, you guys, this is like how many time slots I have. Like time to do actions in the game. I only have one left. He's dirty. He needs to eat. And he usually likes bedtime stories. Um, we work at the factory, Oscar. I don't know what type of factory. I don't remember if it mentioned... Is it possible to press different things in a house? Um, that's a good question. That's gonna take, okay, we can play, but that's gonna take up time. This child needs to, do we feed him now or does this last until the next day? He's gonna be dirty in the morning again. I wanna give him a bedtime story. Merminator, thank you so much for the. Thank you so much for the follow. Well, oh my lord, they just followed you, dude. <laughs> you are a stalker, man. man. It's so cool. <laughs> I'm good. Thank you so much for asking. How are you today? And thank you for the host. Uh, I don't think overtime tomorrow is possible. You don't have food, so you gotta buy food. I know. I agree. What's the setting of the game? Is it during World War II? Yes, it is during World War II. Uh. It, well, it's after World War II, so this is the after results of World War II. Um, these are all the children that were left and abandoned behind um, and adopted out. Uh, and so we play the adoptive parent of this child. Uh, and he 
he wants to know more about his parents. Uh, his parent, his father was a German soldier, so we don't really know much about him. Uh, I contacted the mother in the game. I contacted the mother, uh, asking if she has any more information. But he's dealing with school and bullies, and you know, uh, dealing with discrimination and, and whatnot. And we're trying to, we're trying to, we're trying to be a good parent to him, pretty much. Um, and so it's hard uh, because you have to deal with daily responsibilities feeding and money and work and bathing him and you know you just don't have enough time during the day to do all those things uh and so you're limited with the game and, and whatnot with these time slots here up at the left um so right now like i i, I want to bathe him i want to feed him but i also want to make him happy but i can only choose one uh and i have not been able to read him a bedtime story in the past three days so since i have to bathe him and wash his face anyways tomorrow and he has a tiny bit of food uh, hunger in him. I think I want to read him a bedtime story. Uh, amazing things. How has your day been? It's been really good so far, Mermaid. Thank you so much for asking. Oh, that's sick. I want to play this. I feel that as I am adopted too. So this is close to my heart. Oh, awesome. Uh, it's not free. I am holding a giveaway towards the end of the stream. Uh, so stick around for that. Um, but it is on Steam. And today, the game studio will be holding a Ask Me Anything uh, in their Discord server, so... Oh, I just clicked out of that. Uh, so if you guys want to go ahead and follow them, uh, please do so. You can find out more about the, the game and the franchise. Uh, and yeah, you can ask them anything that you want uh, later today at 5 p.m. Uh, I'm doing good, Dis. Thank you for asking. All right, let's, let's read him a story. Oh, you're so dirty, child. I'm sorry. Uh... Oh. He's not gonna ask for a bedtime story? Okay, so I can... Hmm... We might be doing a giveaway during the AMA tonight as well. Alright, so you got two possibilities of winning, uh, winning the game. Uh, your own version of the game. We love free stuff out of the studio. <laughs> Mmm, so I, it doesn't let me read him a story, so I think I, I want to feed him. Poor thing. Oh no, I don't have food. Can I go to the store? The store is going to be closed, isn't it? Oh no, wash him then. Yeah. Oh, but he's in bed already. How do I get him? Oh no. What's wrong? Hmm. I'm gonna ruffle your hair. What do I do? Hmm. Feed him. I know I tried to. I go and get something to eat for my dinner. I will see you in your next stream. Have an amazing stream. Mermaid, thank you so much. I appreciate you for stopping by. Thank you for the host. Thank you for the follow. Have an amazing day. Thermatusen may still be open. Yeah, but I... Hmm. Okay, well, that's a bug. Oh, that does not look correct. Can you click the ball in the living room since that looks to be in action? Yeah. Yeah. So we have ghosts. We're dealing with ghosts now. So we found one bug. Cool. Glad to help. <laughs> You guys, please follow Set of the Studio. They are the creators of this amazing game, full of feels. Already made me cry. Um, let's give you guys a. <laughs> let's do this. You guys did such an amazing job on this game. I am so impressed. But then, okay, there now he's talking. Okay, so I think the the fact that the ball was in action wasn't allowing me to proceed. So maybe. You received new crafting materials. Okay, have a look. Maybe we can make something with it. A story before we sleep would be nice. Yes, okay, it's okay. Of course, let's read him a story. A new entry has been added to the journal. I love that effect. We read him a story until he falls asleep. Is it a poltergeist or a mare? Haha. <laughs> Asmo reference. I like it. Hmm. Hello, I'm awake and very dirty, little one. Okay. Hmm. Let's check the mail later. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. And clean. And feed. Oh. <gasps> I'll be back. Mamba's gotta run to the store. Mm. Do two of those. Oh, wait, no, no, that's a lot. That's a lot. No, put that back. Um, we'll do one of those. Oh, that's a lot, but we need food. You're not loving the combination of the clothes? <laughs> Alright, let's go back home. Let's feed the child. Um, oh, we have jam, too. Oh, no, I forgot that we could have made the jam. You don't, don't you want to see what I, what we got in the mail? Oh, he really wants me to... Ch okay, let's just feed him first. Yes, we will check the mail. Oh, he wants me to check the mail. Okay. <laughs> oh, uh, it was in the living room. It does cost points. Dang it. Neighborhood Council, this is a warning. We have had numerous complaints about German language being spoken in the neighborhood. This is unacceptable and has to stop immediately. Okay. Um, Kath, if you're still in there, is are those notes uh, real notes as well? Um, for those of you guys that missed it, there are some newspaper clippings that we read in the game. And uh, the studio said that they were... Uh, from real newspaper clippings that they found back from the 1950s. So I'm just wondering if those neighborhood council notices are also real. Okay, let's feed you one more time. Those numbers, those, that the meter is getting really low. Okay, let's go to, what do we do guys? Countess, this is the new game. Yes, it is. How are you? It's it's um uh, it's hard as far as making the right decision for this child. Um he doesn't need a bath yet, did he? He was clean. He's clean. No, I'm sure the Germans were not loved after the occupation, not at all. Um There was there was a new journal entrance. Um uh, there was a new journal entrance for him. Um we read that. So this is what we knew for those of those that missed it. Those notes are based on things that people would say. Okay. All right. Yeah. You can imagine though that it must have been, what a it must have been a really really hard and horrible time. Um, and people don't usually think that about Norway. Like, you know, you come here and you you don't realize how not that long ago it it actually was. The notes are big. Uh, I'm on my lunch break now. How, uh, how nice that you're live. Oh, thank you. I appreciate you for coming in on your lunch break. Thanks so much. It looks sunny aside. He needs summer clothes. You can get the comfort up. The bear. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. I thought that was just like head to the bedroom. Nice to know. Nice to know. Uh, yeah, but this is this is what we know so far about the dad. Um, that we adopted him when he was three years old. Um... And the mom, yeah, the mother told me that your father was a German soldier. She was only 16 and unmarried when she had you. Uh, she refused to say more and that we promised to uh, to stay away from her new life. So I have written your mother. She might want to help, although she doesn't want contact. It's hard to understand why a mother would abandon her child, but many of the mothers who had children with German soldiers did indeed give them away. It is thought around 12,000 such children were born in Norway during World War II, most of them too young and teenagers like your mother. This is the last generation, pretty much, of kids. This is, this is people that, like, my in-laws grew up with. Wouldn't they? No. The generation before, if it was in the 50s, that's 50s, 70s, 70s, okay, so 70. Yeah, 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 that would still be the last generation. But if they were that young, I guess, no, it would be one generation before because they were really young, like 16. That's still so close. It, it, it really isn't that far off. We, Jesus. We interviewed real life Levensborn children, so a lot of the stuff are set on what's been learned from these interviews. Yeah, so they're about like 70 something years old. Go cuddle him now. I'll cuddle, I'll cuddle. Amazing job, baby boomer kids. 
Let's go pet him, you guys. Oh. Oh, we're gonna pet the heck out of him now. Okay. Pet, 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 pet. Tickle, 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 tickle. Yes! We got that up, you guys. All right, another tickle. Yes! Thank you for that. Is it Norway during the 1940s? Uh, we're now we're in the 50s. This is after World War II now. Uh, pretty pretty special there. I've seen many movies about Norway at that time. I know my grandparents were children at that time, but in Sweden, so... Did... Did the Germans occupy Sweden, though? I don't... Oh, after, even better. Yeah, so this is the after results of war. Did they occupy Sweden, though? I'm not so sure. Yeah, they had different situations. He doesn't have to be hungry, for love at least. Oh, but you guys, I have to go to the bathroom. <laughs> we sent them to Norway instead. Yeah. <laughs> All right, you guys, I have to go to the bathroom. I'm going to go on a quick, quick little break. Um, In the meantime, in the meantime, let's see if this works. Um, How about you guys play a little game? Whoa, that water's cold. You guys can go ahead and type that in the chat and see who wins. I'll be right back. Oh no, game over. <laughs> nice. Let's see. What are your scores? Toki 25, Countess 8, Militant 5, Meat Bun 5. Good job, guys. Good job. <laughs> All right. And we are back. No, we do not want to restart the game. All right. Let us get back to this then. Mm -mm -mm. All right. These four letters. Don't let me just catch up with chat. I got no clue how to play. Oh, okay. So you just type in chat. Um, but you fit. Yeah, you figured that out. Yeah, you got that. You got that. That's smooth. <laughs> Orale Swish and Flick, you have 1,165 Gato Taco points. We should sell the drawings now. I don't want to sell his drawings. Okay, so he's good. He's fed. He's clean. His comfort is up. Let us send him to school. We can't send him to school. What am I missing? I don't have enough money. What am I missing? Do I have to... Hmm. Do I have to bathe him? No. 
one point left to spend. Uh, no space in between the exclamation mark and points, Anna. Um, all right, well, let's bathe him. No. I want to play with him. Even though his comfort is up, I, I want to play with him. I could have bathed him, but we're going to have to... Oh, I probably should have. Thank you for my backpack. Let's go to work. Fix last clothes. Ah, oh, dang it. I should have... Mm. The... I should have fixed the last of the clothes. That's right. I could have done that. Okay, we can't work overtime today. Hmm. We have food. Oh, he's so dirty. Oh my goodness. Okay. How was your day? My day wasn't that bad. Everyone was really excited today. We were supposed to have another teacher, Mr. Solheim, but he can't work. I don't know why. We're getting a different teacher called Mr. Badig. I wonder what he'll be like. I sure hope he's nicer to me than Miss Hansen. Mm. I love my backpack. Okay, well, I'm really happy that you're happy. How, he just turned seven. He just had his birthday on, I think it was like four days ago. Um, that's when I make, baked him the cake. Okay, so let's feed you. Let's make something. Um, yeah, I want to cook food. I want to cook in the soup. happy he is. He is so dirty. Was he wrestling at school? Okay, each thing costs a day point, so let's um, let's feed you. Oh, but I have the night points. I still have the night points, right? Okay. Oh, that means no bedtime story and that means no fixing the clothes, but he need that child needs a bath. I want my bed. You know, you need a bath. Mama says... Mama says you need a bed. Now we can go to sleep. But sadly, no bedtime story. Mr. Braddock sounds like someone who might be strict. I hope he's nice. Can you read me that story like, oh, child, I want to, please. <laughs> Set up the way you do this. I want more day points. I want more time slot. I want more time. It's too late, Klaus. It's past your bedtime. No, maybe tomorrow. Oh, but I know that if I say maybe tomorrow, he's already caught me on one of those where he said, you promised. It's too late. Oh, good night then. Oh, sweet baby. Okay. Can I ruffle your hair? Okay. I have no time to do anything else. Sounds about right. Wish it was that easy to cook, right? Just click, 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 click. <laughs> oh, he is so dirty. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, so he's clean. Finally. He's finally clean in the mornings. You can't always say yes to kids, unfortunately. That's very true. And I am definitely one of those parents that tries to say yes as much as possible. Not to spoil, but when it's when it's possible. Um, it's Saturday, so no school today. Yippee. I want to play with Liv today. Okay, have fun. Okay, but let's get you ready first. Yeah, let's get you ready first. Aw, okay. Let's, you need to eat. We have food? Oh, thank God, we have food. Okay. Oh, no, but we have 95 for the weekend. And we... Um... Yeah, but what about now? All done, have fun. Very well, don't be... Don't, but don't stay late. All done. Uh, ah, let's be... Pot. Let's be... Let's, let's be fun. Militant. Mil... <sighs> Thank you so oh my thank you so much for that you got oh Millicent thank you so much oh my god that deserves hold your ears that deserves a <laughs> thank you because we hit Thank you so much, Militant. You didn't... That's amazing. I appreciate you keep smashing it, hon. Oh, I appreciate it so, so much. I appreciate it so much. Thank you. You guys, we reached our 50 goal. Thank you, Militant. You guys, if you guys haven't done so already, please follow Militant. 
please follow Milton. He is just absolutely amazing. Um, I saw him on my recommended list one day and just tuned in. I'm so happy I did. He has such a cool and awesome vibe. Oh um, my god! <laughs> oh my god is right. Did I do that right? Yes, please make sure to follow Milton. I should have popped up a shout out box somewhere. But please follow Militant, you guys. I appreciate that so much. No need to shout me out, hon. Of course I do. I definitely do. Definitely, definitely do. You are such an amazing person. Such a great streamer. You and your community, your community loves you so much for what you do and for what you stand for. And it's just so obvious whenever I'm in your chat. Uh, so I really appreciate. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you so much. Oh, we need a little. Another little. Oh gosh, let's continue. Shout out to Mo. Thank you, Swish. Thank you. I'm leaving to play with Liv. I won't be late. Bye. We have time to do chores. Okay, let's click. Let's let's do the other. Oh, what are those sticks? Hmm. I suck. No. I think. Hmm. No, you did do the shout out correctly, Swish. Cake. <laughs> What it let's see what this is. I should have probably done the clothes. Oh, it's gonna be one of those little toy things, huh? Alright, let's fix his clothes since he's out playing. Oh no, okay. So where do I go to now? Do I go to work? I have to go to work on Saturdays, that's true. Mm, much love guys honestly Sandella. I love the vibe keep killing it thank you so much thank you so much I really appreciate it oh overtime let's do overtime do I do overtime guys this is a very different game than what I normally play but I really really love it I love what set up the studio has done again you guys if you guys haven't uh, followed set up the studio please do so um, there this this game is just absolutely amazing um, and again, they're holding a Ask Me Anything tonight. Also, you could win another chance at winning the game. Um, if you join their Discord, 5 p.m. today, Central European time. They deserve every follow. They, this, this game just deserves to go big and bigger than what it's already been. It's, it's amazing that you can make someone just cry with a few words and small animations. We have one time slot left and he's going to be hungry and he's going to be dirty and he's going to want a bedtime story, but we needed money for the food. Thank you for all the support. No, thank you. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you for, uh, you know, allowing me to be an ambassador for your community. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you for this collaboration and allow me to share this wonderful game with everyone in my community. This is the first time that I am following the stream and really paying attention to the actual game. The first time, Oscar? <laughs> How many streams have you been in, Oscar? Oscar is another in real life friend. He and I um, danced together in the Mexican Folklorico dance group here in Bergen. So, thanks, Oscar. <laughs> yeah, ouch. All right, let's feed you. I can't. Okay, it was saying it was clipping. Oh, okay, hold on. <gasps> Oh no, I have no food, and the store is closed, and tomorrow is Sunday, and the store is closed. We're gonna have to go outside tomorrow. I hope- I hope that's a choice tomorrow. Let me... tickle you. Let me rub your head. I want you to feel good and feel comforted. Cook food. Did I have that option? I did have that- <gasps> Thank you, Meat Bun. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, but that's going to use up a time slot. Oh no, he can't eat it. Don't you have a little left? You have to update your sub goal to 100. Oh, I should. No, I can't do it to 100. I have to be realistic. I have to be realistic, you guys. But let's do... Um, let's do... Let's say 75? We can shoot high. Yeah. This one makes more sense than the Gris, though. 
Dude, I cried with that though. That game was absolutely amazing. There's a clip of it on my on my page, uh, on my Twitch channel. I'm a softy. I'm a softy. I could be a a bad, you know, Mexican Latina sometimes, uh, but I'm a softy at heart. Okay, we don't have time to feed him though, do we? No. Oh no. Five hundred. 500 subs? Jeez. One day. One day. We'll get there, you guys. We'll get there. Uh, can you, would you maybe read me a story? I see. I knew it. I knew it that I'm, I wasn't going to be able to. Oh, no, don't say sorry. Don't say sorry. It's my bad. Oh. Be sure to look at the clip. Mipan, that game, Grace is amazing. I highly, highly recommend it. He's a bit needy with this, with the stories. Oh, Scott, all kids want stories. It's Sunday, so you can come outside with me today. Yes, we will go outside. We can get fish. And we already made the fishing rod. Awesome. I thought it was going to be one of those toys, you know, the, the, with the stick and the string, and you have the little toy and you balance it. I thought that's what I was making, but fishing rod makes sense. Greece is a more subtle game, but did touch on some grief things with atmosphere. It really did. It did touch on on the on the topic of grief and and despair and how to overcome that and everything. Um, and it did, you know, made me think on some personal issues as well. Um, but do highly recommend that game. Let's eat. But this game, this game is touching close to heart just because I am a mom. Uh, I can't relate to so much to the to the war and, and adoption. I can't relate to that, but I can definitely relate to trying to do your best as a parent um, and the struggles and the worries that come with it. It's it's not easy. There's no one no one tells you just how hard that will be. The fishing pole wasn't done. You did one out of three. Oh no! Dang it! I think it's about time to meet this live girl. Is she nice company? That's true. Oh, dang it. You guys are right. If I do two out of three, that's going to use up two. Then we have one afternoon left. And then... But we need food. We need food. You're right. Okay. Let's... Let's do that. In the 50s, going hungry wasn't that unusual. But it doesn't doesn't change how I feel about wanting to provide food for him. His face is clean. Oh, it doesn't matter, right? I can. Oh, that's right. That's right. I can't wait to go fish uh, fishing trip. That's right. I can wash his face to keep his clean meter up. That's right. That doesn't cost a day thingy. Didn't that help? Oh, your shirt's all dirty. Let's change his clothes. Uh, let's put this on you. I really want to go and draw. Oh, I thought we wanted to go outside. Do you want to come and help me? That sounds great. Let's draw something. Um. Oh, no. I can't say. Mm. We have to get food. And the store is closed. Please. I'm sorry. I'm so busy. No, I'm not busy. But we need to go get food. Yeah, I don't see pants. Pretty please stop. Oh. What do we do? He keeps persisting. I'm such a mm, I'm such a softy. I'm the one that's just like finally okay, fine. Sorry about that one. <laughs> Let him have it. Let him have it. Go after to fish. Okay. Okay. Chat says let's go. Oh me? Is that his is that his grandma? Oh me? That's not a Norwegian word that I know, so it's a nickname of some sort. Oh, thank you for drawing with me. This one turned out really good, don't you think? I sure did good job. I think so. Who did you draw? I wanna know who that was. I did, but why did you write that word Omni? I like the who did you draw. It's Omi. She was the nicest lady ever. Such a nice drawing. She must be lovely. Who is she? But when she, but when she, 
Wait, but when was she nice to you? I don't understand. No, that, I don't like the tone of that one. Tickle him and food. Say yes, he's got a hard life. Oh, Scott. <laughs> oh, Scott either comes in with the hard ones, the harsh, hard de the decisions, or the really soft ones. <laughs> Such a nice drawing. She must be lovely. Who is she? Indeed. Let's find out who she is. Oma, German for grandma. Morton! Morton, my love! How are you? How are you, hon? Uh, okay, I didn't know that. Thank you. I did think grandma. Um, okay, so since I know that now, I'm going to say she must be lovely. She was really lovely to me. I think so anyway. I can't remember much. Okay, I thought for a second it was going to take him down memory lane or something and make him really sad. Let's go outside to get food. Because the store is closed, huh? Yeah, the store is closed. Now we can fish. I need some food, finally. So, he speaks German. Well, he was... I mean, he is part German, and he was... I think, um... I think if I'm, if I'm not mistaken, they did keep them in, like... They did keep the kids together, right? Until they were then adopted out? Who knows the backstory on that one? What a cute game. It is. It's based on real-life stories here in Norway, Morton. Um, of the, the kids, you know, poor children, pretty much. I guess the neighbors complained about the German speaking. Oh, that's right. So he must have also said something out loud. Oh, 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 shoot. I'm over here ignoring the... Oops. Some kids were sent to their families in Germany after the war. Okay. Oh, wait, do I... Okay. Ah. Wow, the fishing rod you made works. A new entry has been added to the photo album. Okay, but we can't eat. We got a freaking boot. I would. I would fish the salmons, but I got the boot. Or to make fiske kake. I did. Oh, so it's random. Jeez. We should head back home, I think. Oh. I have no food for him. Okay, he still has some left. Uh, oh, okay, I have time for a bedtime story, thank goodness. I felt so bad for this. I really like playing with Liv. She says I'm funny. And she laughs when I say my strange words. Strange words? Oh my god, that's gonna be the German. You're right. Um, I swish. Swish, it's Morton Morton. Our Morton Morton. The one that left us and moved to Stavanger. Oh, fudge, you'll get fish and can cook it, but you, but it can't feed him. Yeah. Some kids were sent to their families. Yeah, okay. Uh, yeah. Fish some salmons for dinner. No, you got the boot. Press the door. I missed some. It just, like, my chat went really weird for a second. Oh, okay. I'll click the drawing in the corner. Um, don't let her trick you into using rude words. No... Not three, Mr. Fox. I think it's going to be... I think it's going to be the fact that he's using German words. I want to ask what he means by strange words. Yeah, say like Omi. Other strange words too. Liv says they sound funny. See, that's... It kind of reminds me a little bit of my kids because I speak Spanish to my kids. And so it's obviously not the same situation where they're discriminated against, where my kids are discriminated against by the words they use, because my kids do use some Spanish words. Um, here in Norway, kids call their parents like mama or and papa, but my kids call us mommy and papi, and so that already sound, stands out and it's different, but I don't feel or I haven't noticed anything that kids discriminate mine because of the words that they say. Uh, and if anything, it's, it was really cute because uh, one of my son's friends actually referred to me as mommy as well because it's not mama. It's, it's not mom to him. So he's like, mommy? <laughs> this is really cute. But my kids do also use funny words, I guess, or different words. Like agua for water and whatnot. Um, to this is the 50s. I need to head back to work. Have an amazing stream. I really like the game, hun. Keep smashing. I'll catch you soon. Much love, Phoebe's Militant. Thank you so much for stopping by today. Thank you so, so much for helping us reach our goal of 50 subs. I really, really appreciate it. I look forward to your next stream so much and continuing to build on that awesome Minecraft server. Uh, thank you and have an amazing, amazing day.
That is cute. <laughs> is Liv a bit of a bully? No, well, I don't know. I mean, Liv probably doesn't understand. Um, hopefully Liv's parents aren't those that... Um, influence wrong, you know? Uh, it's my pleasure. <laughs> Thank you, Militant. Have a beautiful day. Beautiful man, you. <laughs> I'm still waiting for that uh, 1,000 sub stream, by the way. <laughs> Do not say those words anymore, Klaus. No, let's not say that. Oh, man, but this is the 50s, right? Like, we have to also protect him from these times. This is very different from now. Because right now, I would say to my kid, you use the words that you want to use. Hmm. You should be careful who you say those words in front of. But that makes him very skeptical then to everybody around him and makes him where, uh, what's the word? Very self-conscious of himself as well, even more so. Funny is hopefully not a, yeah, I hope so. Uh, well, so long as you're having fun. Hmm. We also don't want it to dismiss it either, either. He has to be careful in these times. Um. Jesus. Ah, this is hard. Two or he will get... Okay, we'll go with two. I, I agree. Why? Ugh. There are people in the neighborhood that dislike those words. I think we need to be honest. Yeah. Why are they? Have I been saying bad words? No, little, but some bad people used to say them, so don't say them outside, okay? They're strange words. If you don't know them, mean people don't like that. They're, they're strange words if you don't know that. Mean people don't like that. Hmm. Yes, they're bad words. I think I like the first explanation here. Oh, I don't know. I don't know, because then he's going to also think he's bad, right? Yeah, you're right. You guys are right. Number two. Yeah, I don't want him to think that he's bad. Oh. I'll try to be less strange. Oh. Not three. One mean means Omi is bad. Yeah, yeah, I agree. I agree. Your choice is oh yeah. your choice hardened Klaus's heart. Yes, I have time for a bedtime story. Of course, of course I Oh, I should have made food. Oh no! Oh didn't I have berries or something? Alright, no, I should have oh. oops, sorry. I feel like I had probably some chores or something to do. Dang it. You shouldn't think ill of your mother. It is true that some Norwegian women had German boyfriends because they could offer better fo food, luxury items, and parties, and some were also informers betraying other Norwegians. That is actually the case with my um, in-law's friend's father. <laughs> uh, the one that I mentioned before, the one that was uh, captured in the woods here. He, uh, my in my, my father-in-law told me that he was lured by another, another girl. Um, another Norwegian uh, girl that was... Yeah. I'm not sure if it was Norwegian, but it, he, was, he was lured in by another girl. Um, and then taken to the, the war camp. Um, some were also informers betraying other Norwegians, but most were young women who probably simply fell in love. During the occupation, there were over 350,000 German soldiers in Norway, in a country with only 3 million people. Many of them lived in private homes, and many were still teenagers. When you grow older, you'll learn that you can't control who you fall in love with. And that is very true. You can't control who you love with, because love is love, right? Love is love, right, guys? There's some pride up in the chat. Love is love. Hungry again. This is so difficult, just like Sims. Never satisfied with anything. <laughs> but this is a child. This is a child. Do I have... I have nothing to make. I have nothing else to do. Let's start the next day, guys. decisions. Morning, little one. 
Say good morning, Frida. Buenos dias. Okay, let's see. So this game has chapters from what I've been told. Uh, I plan on completing the first chapter today. And maybe we can continue the game. Um, maybe for maybe for Indie Friday we can continue playing the game. Let's read the mail. Oh. Okay, we got a letter. Oh, we have a lot of mail. Look at all this mail. We have no food. What day was it? Was it Monday or was it Sunday? You have to remember pressing the drawings that are lying around the home when they are there. Oh, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Eh. Mm. Okay. That's only when it's at bed. How do I get to the bedroom? Eh, I want to see. There we go. Why you gotta do me like that? Oh, my feelings. My heart. My mommy heart. I love kid art. I love when my sons draw me things. It's just the, oh, it's so cute. It's so sweet. Oh, it's precious. Oh. That's precious. It's tickle you. Ah, King Hokon on the stamp. <laughs> nice. I didn't catch that. Oh, Jesus. No food. Can I go to the store? Oh, thank you, Jesus. Okay. We gotta go with what's cheap. Sorry, little one. Let's do that. Okay. Yes, this art could definitely be sold. Oh, no. That's mine. It's going on the fridge. Oh, I didn't push it. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, two of those and one of those. I forgot to do that. Okay. At home, let's feed you, please. Yes. Om nom nom. Does each spoon... Yeah, each spoon uses time, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's keep it at that. Is this a Monday? No. Th yeah, this is Monday, right? Okay, we have one more task. Let's do the mail. You can feed him as much as you want. Okay. Okay, I thought I was going to use more time. Thank goodness. We need... Let's keep two for dinner. Uh, and let's read the mail. You can feed him as much as you want for one unit. Perfect. Good to know. I don't like, I don't like him starving. I'm sorry, I can't help you. I have a new life and I cannot have it disturbed by mistakes from my past. Close is no longer my responsibility. Do not write again, Siri. Oh. He's not a mistake. In the news, make tasty lingonberry jam. 3 kilos fruit, 1 liter juice, 2 kilos sugar. Use whole nice berries for jam. Boil the berries with the juice for 10 minutes. Put the sugar in a big jar. Pour boiling berries on top and stir. Hmm, <laughs> cute. So maybe we need to go outside and get some berries. Okay. Oh, that's a lie though. We didn't catch the fish. Oh, we got the boot. We got the boot. Okay. Mm. My backpack is so pretty. Let's just wash your face. We should be going. That's true. Do your best today. Don't underestimate yourself. Do your best today. What is the middle thing in the bookshelf? Oh, uh, let's go back. You, we need to update the game with the boot. Okay, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do your best today. I want to say do your best today. Yes. Yeah, because we didn't get the fish. We were hungry. And back to work. We have enough money right now. Okay, good. We don't have to do overtime. Let's... I want to buy this. Make him a nice soup. Oh, no, I knew they were going to tear up his backpack. 
Oh, baby. I'm so sorry I tried to stop them. It was so expensive and now it's ruined. Don't be mad at me, those little brats. Yeah, this has to stop. Yep, that's my first thoughts. Yes, first ask them how he's... Mm. Oh no, are you okay? Or it's not your fault you did nothing wrong. Yeah, let's talk to the principal. Yeah, oh no, and he loved his backpack. He really loved his backpack. Number three or two. Yeah, I, okay, so we have two for Mr. Fox, three or two for Meat Bun, three from Swish. Let's get those kids expelled. I don't know which one I like more. I want to know how he's feeling, but I also want him to know that it's not his fault. So one needs to be the tiebreaker here. I'm also t tied with two or three. I want to talk to the manager. Two. Morton says two. Okay, that was the tiebreaker. They didn't hurt me. I'm just sad. You worked so hard to get me that backpack. Oh, and I couldn't keep it nice and new. Don't be sad, Klaus. I'll fix it. All that matters is that you're all right. If those mean, it's those mean kids' fault, I'll deal with them. That's right. I'm going to go all Karen. I mean, during these times, Karen is probably not possible. It's probably like Kari or something. Just kidding, guys. <laughs> Um, yes, all that matters is that he is all right. Um, yeah, I love that backpack. You did. Don't worry, I'll fix it for you. Um, I'll write a letter to make this stuff. It's a very Karen answer. Um, I wish there was another word for that because, like, no offense to all the Karens out there. Really, you can fix it? We will fix it. Yes, we will. We will get your three backpacks. Really, you can fix it. I'm sorry I couldn't take care of it better. Oh, baby boy, that's not your fault. Okay. Two. Mm. Shower. Feed. And fix backpack. Right? Shower, feed, and fix backpack. He hasn't had a proper bath in a while. Ah, oh, but no storybook. He deserves a storybook. Jesus. Oh, this is hard. This is hard. Okay. And I can't make the food. So, okay. He has food. I can't use the time to make the food. Now I have to fix your backpack. Oh, thank goodness. It's only one. What? No! Putting him to sleep takes a time slot? Of course. Uh, I thought that was like... Mm. Mon 52. Mon 52? Fix it in the morning. Yeah, I'll fix it in the morning. Oh, I have a letter to write. Hmm. Do I have a letter to... Hmm. Okay. How would... Okay. Kenneth and Shadow, I can see that you like anime. Nice, me too. I was watching Evangel Evangelion. Evan I'm sorry if I said that wrong. Evangelion. Okay. But if I read him a story, then can I not write the letter? I mean, obviously, I shouldn't know that. 52-year-old men are also a pain in customer service. I like that. Mon 52, then. Okay, we're going to do Mon 52. No, I wish I wasn't born. Oh, Just try not to attract. No, not just. You don't say just. Just try not to attract any attention. You'll be fine. You're doing great in school. You can do this. The most important thing is to be yourself. I want to say more comforting things. My son pulls that one on me sometimes, too, that he doesn't love himself. It's really hard. Two? Okay. Oh. 
Okay. Good night. Complain. Okay. <laughs> Write a letter to the school to inform them of what has happened. So yeah, I would have probably been a little stuck there trying to figure out what to do, knowing that I, seeing that one point that I have left. Um, yeah, set up that he, because in, so in Norwegian, you have like glideg or alskadeg, which means uh, like, I love you, but glideg um, is what you would kind of say to like your friends or like family, well, Maybe not super, super close family. And alskereg, which is I love you, is what you say to just like your really close family. Or like to boyfriend, girlfriend. That's more of a girlfriend, wife, husband sort of thing. But in Spanish, we don't have that distinction, you know. And so my child just goes around saying I love you to everybody. In, in, in Norwegian, ya alskereg, ya alskereg. And so because there's that distinction in Norwegian, other Norwegian kids are like, do alskemeg? And when he says alskedu meg, and they say nai, you know, they no, I don't love you like that he feels really sad about it and he's said that to me like nobody loves me in Bonahagia and we're having a hard time teaching him that distinction between glideg and alskereg in Norwegian even though there isn't that distinction and difference in Spanish so it's really hard let kids help and give self-esteem grows when kids get to see what they do matters to others choice for I'd be alone if you weren't born yeah. Oh, I like that choice for me, Bun. I'm very happy you're with me. And Glide Egg is so nice. Oh, cool. I like that, John. Oh, no. Oh, I know. Yeah, it breaks my heart when he says that. Fagerstand uh, uh, School. Write the letters now and head it to Klaus in the morning. Some of the other children at school have been cruel to Klaus, and yesterday they ruined his school equipment. I ask that the school do more to address this bullying problem before it gets out of hand. Watch them not be able to help. Okay. Okay, because it had that symbol, but I'm assuming it's this symbol? Yeah. Uh, maybe she was scared. Maybe, maybe she's scared. In 1945, when the war and five years of German occupation ended, many of these young women were paraded as traitors through the streets. Wow, really? Local mobs cut off their hair and they lost their jobs. Although not illegal to have a German boyfriend, it was and still is seen as treason by very many Norwegians. Wow. The hatred towards the occupying enemy and their Nazi ideology grew very strong during the occupation. Now that we've been freed, all things linked to Germany are seen as evil. Therefore, many of these mothers are trying to hide the fact they had a child with a German soldier. Others feel that it's impossible to keep their child. It's hard to get jobs, a place to live, and any respect if you're known as a German slut. Your neighbors won't let you forget. That is absolutely horrible. That is so sad. <sighs> Uh, that's so true. You can only use I love you if you're in love with that person. Yeah. Not if you love them, but if you're in love. Um, so not your friends. This will backfire. I prefer yay dig a egg. <laughs> we were very cruel after the war. Yeah. War brings out the ugly in people. But also for those that know better, it brings out the good. Okay, even more. Why are you sad? Let's give you some tickles. Can I tickle you? Oh no, I can't tickle. Okay, he's smiling, he's smiling. No? Tickle, 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 tickle. No, oh, can I play ball? Oh, I have things to do though, huh? I have to fix the backpack. Jesus, I have to feed him and I have to fix the backpack. But we have no food. We have no food. Oh, Jesus, this is hard. Fix that backpack. Buy food. Feed and fix backpack. But, okay. Yes. I've not heard of this today, so that's great. I wonder when it stopped to be normal to see them as... Uh, I stopped when it's... I wonder when it stopped being normal to see them as traitors. I don't think anyone would care today if mentioning, if mentioned being Norwegian German. 
Yeah, Mr. Fox has a little bit more insight into this because I think what was, I mean, if you want to write about that, Mr. Fox, you said that you worked with some of, I think you mentioned something about that, like working like um, volunteer work with some organization, or that was for asylum seekers, I think you mentioned. But Mr. Fox knows a lot about this, actually. Um, no need to go, need to go have lunch. Very nice watching you play. Thank you so much for stopping by today. Thank you again for this opportunity. I'm really enjoying this game. Have a nice lunch. We're going to go feed Klaus some breakfast now. Let's buy him some, mm, this requires time to make. Let's buy him this. Okay. Let's go back home. Let's feed you. Um, let's give you something yummy. Okay, chomp chomp, and let's fix that backpack. Yeah. The kids- oh, that was really, really badly fixed. Yeah, I mean, the kids in the 50s are the 70, between, yeah, 70 year oldish um, folk here now. Um, so they're still around. You did it. You fixed my backpack. It's almost as good as new. Haha, <laughs> enjoy it, Klaus. That's how I feel looking at that ropes, that rope strap. Just be more careful. No, that wasn't your fault. If this happens again, don't blame yourself, okay? I think I like number three. We are a bit subtle about racism and fear of others, but subtle racism is, yeah, subtle racism is still very, very, very apparent. Um, and exists, definitely does exist. I would only know of extreme Christians, as we would say, maybe some persons. Uh, I'm gonna say that one. Oh no, that was the wrong choice, wasn't it? That music. Okay, your choice. Mm, yeah, I wish we would have probably said the same thing. Okay. We gotta head out. I know that big boys have to go to school, but it's really hard. Take this letter to your teacher. It should help. Just try to avoid the nasty kids, okay, today? Okay. Um, but we kind of, okay. I want to say number two, but we have to give him the letter. His heart will become stone. No, Countess, but what we have something called Yantelov here, sadly. Uh, Whoa, yeah. that water's cold. Thank you for the hydrate. Okay. Mm. No, we're not going to say maybe it'll make things worse. And I'm not going to promise fully. I'm going to be honest and say that I do hope so. I don't think the letter's going to help either. Watch Mr. Berg or whatever the teacher's name was be the same. And I'll deliver it. I don't like school, but at least you help me. Oh, look at him with this rope strap. Oh. The letter will backfire. I think it will. I think it is going to backfire on me. Where is he? Is he a ghost again? Where is he? Hiding in the closet. Ah! Oh! <sighs> I wish you never made me deliver that stupid letter. Ah. Oh. What happened, or are you okay? Um, are you okay first? Oh, one? Okay. Okay, you guys want to know what happened. The teacher read the letter out loud in the class. She said that I was a snitch. Then she made me stand with my arm. Then she made me stand with my arm up in history class. Okay, and the reason I react really... 
Strong says because this is based on real things and thing like the this is this is like information that was this is this is true. This is like people were actually interviewed. This is probably something that really did happen. That was normal. That's re I mean, yeah, okay. I Yeah, I guess obviously it doesn't make it okay, but like, you know, if if we think back also, uh I mean from the states and kids used to get beat in school too, and that's also horrible and harsh um for us nowadays too. So I guess yeah, that that it makes sense that that would be normal. No, I can't believe this. We can't even trust the teachers. The teacher too. Oh no, I'm so sorry, Klaus. I th I want to say sorry. Yeah, dude. Yes, back in the days this was normal. My parents even had shame corner and got hit on the fingers if naughty. That's true. That's true. I actually, yeah, I got sent to the auditorium once. They put a desk in the middle of the auditorium, an empty auditorium, and they made me sit there. My mom wreaked havoc for that, but even back in my days, sort of shameful things like that were still practiced in schools. That's good. But it isn't your fault. You try to help. Oh, let's give you a, let's put a sweater on you, sweetheart. Let's go feed you. Mm, he's so sad. I'm sorry for being upset with you. You're always standing up for me. That makes me feel better. I'm tired. All right, sweetheart. What is wrong with me? Nothing's wrong with you. You're perfect. Why would you ask that? Don't say things like that. Number one. I Oh, I forgot to pet him. Yeah, I'll pet him tomorrow. One. Okay. My teacher made me bleed once because he threw a, marketing, oh, a marking pen at my head. Oh my gosh. My teacher got in, I think she got fired... Or my mom, yeah, she stabbed me in the back with a pencil. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah. Switch, did you go to Mexican school? I grew up in the 80s, and shaming and hating different was a thing from grown-ups as well. Your monitor is about to turn off. Press OK to continue. What? Why would my monitor turn off? Ah! One second. There we go. <laughs> Why would that sense that there was nothing, no activity on my monitor? Um, oh no, I don't know what I clicked. Jesus. Um, there's nothing wrong with you, Klaus. Go to sleep now. Well, you are. Stop thinking about them. Oh no. You got beat on the fingers, too. Um, okay. But I want to read him a story. Yes, 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 yes. I can read you a story. Unless I have other things to do. The Bergen suburbs were rough. Swish. <laughs> Spanish tube. Um... I had a teacher who got fired. We had trouble boy in our class and he was a bit too hard on him. Nicely told. Cook food could be one. True. True. Good. <gasps> yes, Smeet Bun. Um, okay, good night then. Good call. We have food for in the morning. We need to be responsible sometimes, too, even though I want to. Okay, we'll have to mend this later, then. But let's put him to sleep, then. Oh, sweet baby. It's morning. I'm glad that I have my backpack back. Okay. Go wash your face. as high as it goes uh, and let's feed you some soup chump chump he is sad he is sad I'm gonna pet him right now I don't like I'm gonna comfort him I'm gonna comfort him right now oh baby boy um, okay so I can fix the clothes right now since I have time Let's do that. Okay. Yeah. My food ingredients. Very true. 
We should go now. Okay, but hold on. Just try to get through the day. It'll be fine. It'll only be for a short while. Don't be sad. Um, I mean, I can't promise how rough he's gonna... I can't, I can't promise if it'll be short or not. Yeah, I agree. I think number one is the best thing to say. I'll try. Oh, baby boy. Okay, let's go buy food first. Miss. I'm gonna have to buy the cheap stuff because this stuff makes... takes a whole day slot, so we're just gonna do... Okay. Okay, head to school and head to work. We're good on money. For now. At home. Why are people saying I am a German kid? I'm not German. Uh, those brats have no idea what they're talking about. I like how the first one is always the first thing that actually comes to my mind. The bullies just want to rile you up. Did those mean kids pick on you again? What is to the left and right on the shelf in the store? Ha. Huh. I'll check on that. I'll check that later. Um... Hmm... Yeah, two would probably harden his heart. Okay, you guys are right. No, Miss Hansen. Hmm, she told me the whole class that I'm a jerk. That? Hmm. Okay, I don't want to say number three, though, because... He is part German. What a B-word, I agree. <laughs> but he is part German. Um, I guess in those times, obviously, it wasn't something to be proud about, I guess. But I'm of that nowadays, you know, that that's what I, I'm proud of being Mexican, even though I'm an American and a Norwegian citizen. What I am is very important to me. But may obviously not in those times, I guess. Number two. Okay. Why would they say that? Is it about my parents? You would do your you would do best to ignore that type of talk. Can we talk about this later? Tell Klaus what you know. I think we should tell him what we know. I think it's best for him to be prepared. We can't keep avoiding it, and he's gonna keep just he needs to have some support, I feel stay out her way. Oh my god, I would meet up at the school and they would remember it for a long time just like my mom did for me. Good for your mom. Good for your mom. I think I want to tell Klaus what we know. Right? What do we think? Jam Jam! How are you, hun? Thanks for stopping by! Chip says, yeah, okay. Sleepy Ginger Fox, hi, Han. How are you? Okay, we'll do number three. Jam Jam, big brother. I swear you are everywhere, girl. You're such an amazing supporter of everyone. Uh, let's feed him. Your father was a German soldier. He was here in Norway during the war. The truth is, look, I'm sorry, I just can't tell you. No, 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 no. Let's, I, I feel, okay. Oh, Seven is really young about to be listening to all of this stuff. But, again, different times. I'm good. How are you? I would have been here sooner, but I've been cleaning a lot. No, Jam Jam, thank you. I appreciate you for stopping by anyways. Thank you. I, <laughs> You are everywhere. I really appreciate you stopping by. Um, we are playing this game, My Child Levin's Born, and it's, it's tough. It's tough being a parent. Uh, kids are resilient. Uh, I'm going to go with one, you guys. You guys think number one? Truth is better. Yep. It's hard. Your choice softened. Oh, good, 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 good. Okay, and that's all I know so far. Your mother gave you away because your dad was German. Okay, we're not going to say that. Truth, but specifics can be <laughs> avoided a little bit. I would visit that teacher with the Ustehovel. <laughs> I'm good. Sorry about being muted at the last game when I played DBD with you my mom called and she just no sleepy ginger no 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 not at all you don't need to apologize no it was fun to play with you it was a lot of fun 
Uh, one, yes. My dad was German. Thank you for telling me. Oh. Let's pet. I can't tickle him anymore. I can't even pet his. Okay. It's not even going up. I can't comfort him at all. Oh, no. What do you guys think? Should we play ball with him a little bit and then feed him? That's the two time slots left. <laughs> Give him some food. Yeah, but I also want to play with him. Do we? Ha yeah, we have. We have food. Um. Mm, I guess we'll just do bread and cheese for now. We'll do two bread and cheeses since we have good. Yeah. Um. I want to fill him up all the way. We only have. We'll wait till tomorrow. Give him some food. Sleepy Ginger Fox is high. Yeah, it was a lot of fun to play um, Dead by Daylight together with you guys. That was a lot of fun. I definitely want to play again. Um, wouldn't he appreciate a bedtime story more? But I, I do have I do have the nighttime slot. Right now I have one afternoon time slot and then the night one has... Uh, nighttime has one. So I'll save the bedtime story for the night one because I don't have anything to mend. Um, I don't have anything to cook. He could do with the bath tomorrow morning. He could do with the bath and food tomorrow morning for the morning slots. I really want to play with him. I'm going to play with him. Please go up with comfort, little one. Oh, thank goodness. Okay, now I can tickle him. Yes. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Oh, that makes me happy. Uh, wouldn't he appreciate uh, idea? Cook food during weekends. Could stock up on good feeling food that way. And fish during weekends too, of course. Yeah, go outside, get some berries and fish on the weekends. He needs to play then, but that will make him dirty. No, not with the ball inside. So see, now we have time for the... Uh, now we have time for... The bedtime story. Good. Good night. Thank you for fixing my backpack. I just want you to be happy. Thank you for being so patient. You're welcome, Claus. I want to say thank you for being so patient. That's a good virtue to have. I think it's important that they know that they are... Their little feelings and what they go through is also very much appreciated and that they are acknowledged. They say that Germans are bad guys. You can't trust what they are saying. We don't know if your dad was a bad guy or not. Oh, I don't want to have him worry about that. Um, <laughs> dot 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 is kind of where I'm at. Um, I think go for number one. That's true. Okay, good. So the Germans were the good guys. Ooh. That's not what I meant. Uh, it's complicated. <laughs> Shoot. You just keep digging yourself. You just keep digging yourself further and further. <laughs> oh, man. Um, two. Yeah, it's complicated. I don't understand at all. Things have changed a lot now that I'm... Oh, he thinks he's grown up. Now that I'm growing up, I was really looking forward to starting school and being around more kids. I thought it would be nice. I don't understand why they have to be so mean. Miss Hansen and some of the grown-ups, they look at me like I've stolen or broken something. See, kids pick up on so many, so many small details. Maybe, uh, well, um, they're obviously making it really obvious, but just like glances and whatnot, they really do pick up on all of that stuff. I haven't, I've been good, really good, not even getting a backpack worked. Um, maybe there is something wrong with me. My parents weren't married. Was that because I'm bad? My dad is German. Maybe if he's bad, then I'm bad. Oh my goodness. But I don't even know him, so how can I be bad? That's right. Liv and me and you, we're the only good people. She doesn't like it when the other kids get angry. So that answers our question. Liv is not a bully. Then she goes and hides. Oh, I'll try to hide more too. Oh my gosh, but this is my best hiding place because you're here to chase the bad people away. I'm tired. Could you read me a bedtime story? Oh, of course, little one. Yes. New entry has been added to the journal. What is that, Mr. Fox? What is Utenvoskop? No worries, Countess. You have a nice lurk. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. 
All right, let's end the day. Chapter complete. I think this is, uh, yeah, this is what I wanted to uh, reach today. 43% optimistic, 20% assertive, 35% open. You and 72% of others bought a backpack. Oh. You and 63% of others told Klaus about his parents. You and 56% of others warned against German words. Thank you, Sarefta. This is really interesting to compare with what others have chosen. That's amazing. Uh, left outside of society. Okay. Utenfoskap. Oh. Alright. Well, you guys, I think we will have to continue this another time. Um, let's, uh... I think we'll have to continue this another time. This was really interesting um, to play. Sarepta, again, thank you so much. Uh, congrats. Yeah, love that side. Hey there. Hey, Shady Lady. How are you? Uh, can you guys hear the music? Let's do a little, let's do a little happy, a little happy playlist here. Um, it looks like a really good and informative game. It, it really was. I really did, um, really did like that. It obviously, it made me cry. Um, uh, so it did hit the feels. I think you guys did an amazing job with, with the story, the narrative, even the animations, the little, you know, the stomping in the fist. It's just very, very... Um, realistic as to how a kid would react like my kid does that all the time um, so it definitely hit this mama's heart I know it uh, definitely hit some people in the chat as well that are that are parents as well um, still a bit sleepy but doing great oh oh uh, what time is it for you shady I want to play it yeah I will be doing a giveaway right now so um, if anybody is in lurk mode and can hear this we will be doing a uh, a giveaway uh, let me just bring this over here. Um, all right. So you guys, let's put a, we'll put a timer. We'll do it in five minutes. Um, so to enter the game code giveaway, type join. Anybody that types join will be in the, in the hat, sort of say. Um, oh my God, Toby just called. And me and said he made a bet with his boss. The winner is the one who becomes the fittest in three months. The winner gets a vacation. <gasps> That's cool. You guys, is the music too loud? Reactions differ according to different gameplay, but the story does not. Um, okay, the story does not. Hold on, let me just bring you guys over here. Um... Uh, 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 we wanted to refrain from changing the events too much since it would suggest real life Levinsborn children could have just chosen the right choice. That makes that makes a lot of sense. I, uh, yeah, that makes really sense. Whoa, really... that water's cold. <laughs> Thank you so much for the hydrate. I forgot to put the timer on. Okay, in five minutes we'll roll. That this game, yeah, I, I, I'm looking forward to continuing playing the game. Um, we can. Did you bring it back? Tell them play that shit again. Tell them turn up the bass. Did you turn it up? Better did you bring it back? Tell them did you turn it up? Better did you bring it back? Tell them did you turn it up? Better did you bring it back? Tell them play that shit again. Oh, and from Sadetta, thank you. <laughs> Let's get things happier. I agree. I agree, you guys. Um really really amazing game um this friday uh i'll continue playing the game this friday um let's get you guys some little stars to jump for you guys uh here's some stars here's some bombs oh you guys coming in with those hugs that's very cute bounce around everyone bounce around what is this click spawn avatar oh i can spawn different thingies too more stars for you guys Ah, uh, let's see. What did you guys think? What did you guys think of the game? Oh, that's a lot of points going in. Pass the vibe check. <laughs> I am glad. 
did I come in for the ending? You did come in for the ending. Yes, you did. I stirred. Oh my god, I've been going for three hours now. I've been going for three hours. Um, played an amazing game. Um, my child Levin's born. Very, very um, full of information and history and just really gets you thinking. Um, how our words can affect others. Uh, I like it. Also feel I would be much better parent to this kid than to my own. <laughs> oh no, Anna. Anna, you're an amazing mother. Don't say that. Maybe I should stop playing until 3 a.m. Oh my gosh, 3 a.m. I used to do that. I used to do that. I'd say let's help this kid to achieve great things. We can do this. We can do this and we will continue on. We will continue on a um, Friday. Uh, we got two more minutes, 45 seconds, um, you guys, to join that giveaway. So go ahead and type uh, exclamation mark join, no spaces in between. Um, and when, yeah, we got two more minutes on the clock. See who who wins the game code. Um, again, you guys uh, said at the studio is going to be holding in. Ask me anything. So any questions um, that you have for the game studio about the game or the franchise, um, please join the Discord at this link here. They'll be holding the Ask Me Anything today at 5 p.m. Central European time. Um, and looking looking forward to it. Uh, everybody, let's thank them for, for just hype them up for this creation of a game. Thank you so much for stopping by, uh, Sarapta, uh, and Kath, if she's still on her lunch. Um, I really, really appreciate it again. Uh, looking forward to continuing the game. I want to win the free iPad. There is no free free iPad. <laughs> There's no free iPad being given away. It is the game code for the uh, for the game itself. And again, you have another chance. If you don't win right now, there is still one more opportunity if you uh, attend the Ask Me Anything at the Discord. Again, this is the link for the My Child Community Discord server. This is, if you guys want to join here and win a chance here, type exclamation mark join. We have one more minute on the clock. Looking forward to doing many great things with you as an ambassador. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. I appreciate that a lot. Um, let's see. Sleepy Teacher Fox hype. Yes, you guys, hype it up. Hype it up. <laughs> oh, it actually types the emote. Um, the emote in the avatars. It's super cute. I love those shady blady. Whose are those? Those are such cute emotes. Just. Frost gem. That's meow. adorable. Meow, 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 meow. <laughs> meow, 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 meow. Swish. Meow. Hey, you subscribed. Does it feel good? Jam, thank you so much for the follow, you sweet person. You, I, oh, thank you, Jam. Oh, <laughs> you're amazing. Thank you so much for the subscription. Oh, Scott, you know well enough. I, this exclamation mark join. <laughs> it's from Frost Gem. I saw. They're super, super cute. Uh, Swish, can you find Chimmy, please? Somebody redeemed. Find pet. Sleepy Ginger, we got four seconds. All right, all right. Let's see, let's see, let's see. All right, let's roll it. DJ! DJ won the giveaway! Awesome! Did he... Just trying to see if he was in the. I thought DJ left. Was DJ here? DJ left. DJ didn't write exclamation mark join, did he? DJ's not even here. <laughs> let's check. <laughs> let's roll it. Let's, uh... let's roll it again. Let's roll it again. Let's roll it again. There we go. DJ's not even here. Oscar. Congratulations. <laughs> oh. Ugh. And here is your kitty kitty, Mr. Fox. Oh. oh, congratulations, Oscar. Yeah, DJ wasn't here. I think that was a little a little mistake on Nightbot's um and Yeah, it's kitty kitty. He's so warm. I think he was down in the in the basement in our bathroom. Um, 
uh, that where we have the heating cables. Oh my god, I love that kitty cat. That's super, super cute. Oh, he's such a... Oh, I love him. He's such a derp. He's the one that's in my hype button. His name is... Uh, oh, my lights went off. I didn't even notice that. I've been streaming for that long. Um, Oscar, I will send you the game code for the, for the game. Thank you so much, you guys, for being here. Uh, I appreciate you guys all so, so much. Thank you so much for all the subscriptions, for all the hype, for all the love, all the support. Uh, if you guys want to join my Discord, please do so at this link right here. We, I am on mostly every single night. There's a few of us always on in the Hangout the voice chat, um, either playing games or just chatting and whatnot. Um, pretty active on there, so I would love if you guys joined. Um, if you guys want to follow me on my other socials, you go ahead and then just... Uh, Click the link to my about section. Uh, I post on TikTok. I try to do my best to post more on Instagram and Twitter. Um, I have cat hair everywhere now. Uh, and you guys, thank you. Thank you so much for being here again. Um, I wish you guys all a beautiful day. I still have cat hair on my nose. I can see it. Yes, happy Pride Month, Nightbot. Happy Pride Month. You love the people. Have a beautiful day. Thank you for today's stream. And I will see you guys on Wednesday for Spooky Wednesday. We'll see what we'll see what game we play. Oscar didn't didn't actually enter but deserves it. Did Oscar not enter? I thought he Did Oscar not enter? Oh my god. Okay, but Oscar has been active. The point was for the people, of the, the last people, in the last five minutes to be active. <laughs> I'm not gonna roll it again. <laughs> okay, guys. You guys, um... Thanks so much. Have a lovely, lovely, lovely day. Thanks so much for the gifted sub militant. Oh, awesome. Alright, guys. Let's find somebody to raid. Let's find somebody to raid. Stick with me. Stick with me. Let's find someone to raid. Ah, uh, let's see. Mm -mm -mm. I don't have that many on. Let me find someone from my um. Let's find. I want to find somebody from my um. Team XO. I'm on a tree. Uh, team. My stream team. Apologies. There we go. I'm on my stream team. Uh, team XO. Um, uh, yes, now we can hype up train, you guys, or raid. We have an amazing team. Uh, go ahead and follow them. Let's see who is on. Lizzie is on. Official Coop is on. I Kissed a Girl is on. I Kissed a Girl has one viewer right now. I want to raid them. They are playing Call of Duty. So let's hype them up. Go ahead and copy that if you guys are a... Copy that hype and let's let's do this. Okay, raid. I kissed a girl. Oops. Underscore. X O. Show them the love, you guys. Again, be respectful, mindful of their wishes and rules in chat. I appreciate you guys. You guys. I appreciate you guys all so much. Have a lovely day and let's go crazy in I kissed a girl's chat. Bye, guys. And rating in six viewers already. Six viewers already. There we go. I won't be able to join last game meeting. No worries, Nipun. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate you. We'll talk later tonight. And let's raid now. Bye, guys. <laughs>